Hello, hello, ladies and gents. Welcome back. How are we doing? How is everyone? Getting the last bit set up. I've had a mega productive day today. Holy... Oh, we got Mia coming in as well. Mia. Hey, girl. Come on, him. Come on. All right, we have Mia content inbound. Welcome in, everyone. What's up, Nitro Walker, Beto, Steven, Scott, Nick, Pricey, Rob, Zero, Torpedo. Welcome in, everyone. Welcome in. Happy Friday. We've got some community races tonight. I have not played this game since uh, the preview race. I've been doing eye racing. I've been grinding. I've been grinding. Get ready for tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be an exciting one as well. We've got two bangers uh, in the space of 24 hours. Welcome in, ladies and gents. Happy Friday. Good, good to see you. Show tomorrow at Castle Coombe. Happy days. Hey, that sounds amazing, Barnsley. Thank you so much for the 25 month resub. Absolute legend. Hope you enjoy that, mate. Kev as well, the three month. Absolute boost. Legend, Kev. Thank you, mate. Um, hey, GB, three months. Three months indeed. Thank you so much, Kev. Um, I've just been looking at my activity feed. Thanks to you, lovely gents with the subs. Did Alex raid me? <laughs> I said Alex Gillen raid, raided 33 minutes ago. I was not even close to being live then. <laughs> I don't know whether it's because he's uh, he's going to be over here tomorrow. So Alex is um maybe maybe Alex was saying to uh, to check out the race tomorrow because uh we'll be live doing Sebring 12 hour Sebring tomorrow. If you type exclamation mark stint in chat, that might not be final. Um, but the time for me, Alex, and Ben should be accurate. I don't know whether, like, Razin, Fabio are doing the exact times in there. But if you type exclamation mark stint... Oh, it's a bit of a mess, that command. Uh, I'll try and tidy that up in a sec. But, yeah, um, that's the that's the running order tomorrow, I think. So, um, those are times as well. I should, I'll, I'll update that really quickly. I've got Mia with me right now. He's currently just purring away on my lap. Uh, she doesn't want to be budged at the moment. Look, Mia. Look, who's that? No, no. No. <laughs> she's just she's just chilling. She's found her bed and she's lying down. Um are we doing F1 discussion and William's stupid decisions? Uh yeah, I am I in the mi minority that doesn't think it was stupid? I, I look, it's Bruce or one Logan. I don't I'm not saying I necessarily agree with it, but I understand like James Vowles isn't wrong when he said he's putting the team first in terms of, let's be honest, chat, Alex Albon is more likely to get points than Logan Sargent. He has proven that over a long period of time that he is just quicker with the current car setup or whatever it is. Um, so, yeah. So, I understand why they've done it, but it is brutal because Logan Sargent didn't do anything wrong. Alex Albon crashed and then suddenly Albon gets his car. 
if it's like Leclerc and Sainz, then obviously that doesn't happen. But because there's such a gap in the driver performance, like for example, if, if Red Bull did that with Max and Checo, I would understand it less just because Red Bull have already won the constructors, clearly. But it would still make sense from a Red Bull perspective because Max is just that far clear of Checo. Still no Mia Cam. I know. I pro I promise you. I'm. I will say actually zero. I am. Uh, because I've got like another camera in the background. I will probably set something up for tomorrow. I don't know whether I just put like a little stream deck button, but I'm going to try and set up like another webcam to the side or something so you guys can see, uh, for example, if Ben's racing or I'm racing or Alex is racing and maybe I'll, maybe I'll park up like a stool or a chair next to the rig. If we have another camera so that you can see the, the person spectating or talking next next to the rig, uh, that might be quite cool. So that could inadvertently become a Mia cam as well. So leave it with me. I've been super busy today. I've been um, getting the house ready as well for tomorrow because we're we're hosting not just Ben and Alex, but um, our other halves are coming along as well. Um, so there'll be six of us. So we're, we're kind of planning some games and some fun stuff tomorrow. We're doing go-karting as well, by the way, guys. We're literally going go-karting, coming back, jumping straight in the rig and doing, doing Sebring. So when you guys see me tomorrow and see us three, um, we'll be kind of post-go-karting sweat mode. So um, yeah. That, that could either be disastrous or it could mean we're warmed up already. We will find out. Uh, Scott, by the way, said that was the exact reason Alex rated. Yeah, it makes sense. I, I saw it at first and I was shocked and then I realized. And I realized actually it does make sense. But yeah, I know, that, I know there's multiple requests for Mia cam chat. It will, it will be coming. Mia's, Mia's quite sporadic when she, when she decides to come in here. But when she does, she likes to just kind of Set at the base of the rig in her little loaf stance, just chilling there while I'm yelling. You right, girl? She's just kind of <laughs> she, she's very cute at the moment. I think she's um she's not long woken up, so she's a bit groggy. She's a bit groggy. You enjoy your iris? I am indeed, mate. I am indeed. A uh, golf for the 21 month reason. Absolute legend, dude. Thank you so much, golf. I appreciate that. Happy March Madness. Oh, this cat hair's going everywhere. Who do you have winning the big dance? Yukon look good, but I don't think they'll repeat. Wait, hang on. What? Who do you have winning the big dance? Yukon look good, but I don't think they'll repeat. You're going to have to explain that to me, Golf. I'm lost. <laughs> I'm not sure. I've got no idea. But yeah, Nihal, by the way, if if um if uh Albon does bin it in Sergeant's car, oh my god, that's that's going to look awful on not only just him but the team as well. That that will be bad. Album, album better hope he doesn't write that car off, basically. Or write the chassis off. What's up, GT? Welcome in, dude. Yeah, exactly, Rob. Like, it is, it's harsh on Logan Sargent, but Albon is... It is it's, it's, a, it's a fact. It's not... You know, it can be statistically backed up. Um, I feel for Logan, genuinely. Like, I'm, I, had the, I had a similar reaction to a lot of you guys, but I don't... I don't dislike Williams or James Vowles or anything like that. Like, I've seen some pretty extremist views on that. And it's like, well, I understand it. You know, like, they're, they're, at, they're, at, they're at an end of the sport where they need the money to survive. So they need to take every... They need to maximize every possible chance of getting points, right? And that's one of them. What's up, Nigel, by the way, mate? Welcome in, dude. What's up, George? Uh, big US college uh, basketball tournament is on now. Oh, damn. Okay. All right. Well, I'm clueless with that. But uh, whoever you want to win, I hope they win. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much for the reset, man. I appreciate that. I appreciate it. I've actually got a, I've actually got an uneaten cheesecake next to me as well, which I planned on scranning before I went live, but it kind of didn't happen. Uh, but yeah, we're going to be doing some racing tonight, guys. Uh, I'm going to be munching on my cheesecake shortly, and I'm going to be kicking Mia off my lap because that's why we're still waffling away. She's She's kind of... Comfy here. Right, Mia? <laughs> She's fully asleep. <laughs> oh, I'm going to have to wake you up. You're not going to like it. You're not going to like it. Seita says it's the team's fault, really. Val's kind of said as much. It's unacceptable for them not to have a uh, spare chassis. I agree. And I think his reasoning was that they'd like... Because they'd maxed out everything else. Like, they'd maxed out all their resources. They, they didn't have the capability to have the extra chassis, right? But I think he said in, in that I did watch that whole interview he, he put out and he was basically like, Oh yeah, we're um we're yeah, we're not gonna have this situation again. We'll make sure we've got a spare, basically. 
Because you see, think about the odds as well of them actually damaging the chassis on the weekend that they don't bring it. Like that's they're also quite unlucky. I mean, it was it was Albon's fault, obviously, but like the whole series of events to lead to now is quite unlucky. I do feel for Williams because they're not a team. You know, if it's a Mercedes or a Ferrari, you know, or an Aston, you're kind of like, well, that sucks. That's not good. But at least you know, at least they can afford it. Whereas like Williams is like you know, a, they're a small team on a small budget. The pressure on Albon to score points now is unreal. I don't, I, I don't know if there's pressure on Albon to score points necessarily because wherever Albon finishes in the race and in quali, look, I mean, maybe Sargent could have done better, but it, it's likely that he would do better than Sargent regardless. Even if Albon doesn't score points, if he finishes like P12, it's likely Sargent would have been lower, you know? Of course, you never know, but yeah. I just think there's there's pressure in the sense that if he does crash the car, then yeah, that's, that's bad. <laughs> that's, that's not good. That is not good. Could you imagine if he damaged the, the chassis in quality chat and then there's no Williams in, in the race? How crazy would that be? <laughs> that would be absolutely crazy. What's up, Ahmed? Welcome in, dude. Hope you're doing well, mate. Um, Harry, by the way, appreciate the follow before. Appreciate you, dude. Welcome in, everyone. We are back. It is a Friday night stream, which means we're going to be alive for a while tonight. We are going to do Australia later. We've got short qualifying, 50% race. I've obviously done no... Um, laps or driving of F1 in general. I have been grinding my safety racing and iRacing so that I've been able to get a C license so that I can race tomorrow. So guys, this is going to sound bad because it is bad. I have not done a single race tomorrow uh, for tomorrow. I've not done a single race in preparation for tomorrow in the LMP2s and at, at Sebring. Like I've not done like a proper race. So I don't know what it's like with traffic. I don't know what it's going to be like in changeable conditions. I'm slightly nervous for that. I will try and do some preparation for tomorrow, but because the guys are coming over, there's obviously a lot we're, we're doing. So, yeah. <laughs> I, know, I know, Nigel. It's not good. It's not good. I've got to survive for an hour. I'm only doing one hour. It's going to be three hours on my account, but it'll be Ben, me, and Alex sharing those. Ben and Alex have played a lot of iRacing. They know what they're, they know what they're doing. Alex has practiced a lot as well. Um, I've been watching him do uh, multiple streams and, and sessions. So Alex should be cooking, but they'll be on my rig. So, you know, my, my brake pedal is a short travel, firm pedal. Whether Ben and Alex are going to be comfortable with that, we'll see. But hopefully they'll, I'm sure, well, I'm sure they know what to do in iRacing. So hopefully they'll, they'll dial, they'll dial themselves into my rig, you know, in the first kind of 10 minutes or so. And then, and then hopefully they'll be okay on their stint. Kelly says, oh, Lord, GB, you're in trouble. I've done the LMP2 in test session. Like, I've, I've, I'm not quick, obviously. I've only just started playing iRacing. Um, I'm going to be probably the most disadvantaged driver in, in, the, uh, in our group. But um, I have driven the LMP2, at least. I, I'm not going to be, you know... I know my breaking points, put it that way. In the dry, that is. In the wet, is not so great. But hopefully, I'll avoid the wet. Um, Scott, how are you getting on with F1 as well, mate? Scott's uh, new to F1. He just started playing it. Uh, Walker, by the way, said thoughts on Creator Series Canada. Yeah, guys, there's actually a lot to talk about. There's um, new teammates are coming out. Safso was announced for Alpine today. I genuinely do not know my teammate. I've been... Um, I think a couple drivers do know. A few drivers do know. Uh, the, uh, there's been a, been a few whisperings going about. Um, I've actually kept away from that. I uh, even, even Safso and Ben know who my teammate is, but I... I specifically wasn't like asking them to tell me because I'm I'm down to I'm down to just find out with you guys when we get the social post. I don't know who who is my teammate. If I would guess, I would guess El Rey Giri, who was my teammate in season three, I believe. Um, I'd like to be teammates with El Rey again, but I don't know. I would I would guess someone like El Rey maybe. Um, depending on attendances, maybe Tom ninety seven. We'll see. Because, I, I, guys, I'm going to be missing round one already. So, you know, attendance is my biggest issue. It looks like we're not going to be off to a good start in terms of the championship standings. Um, so, yeah, I don't know who my... Maybe my teammate will be based off the fact that, okay, I'd normally score pretty high points, but, like, I, I might not be turning up to too many races, you know? Imagine you're with Alex, Nico and Lewis 2.0. That would be really cool. If, if Alex was my teammate, that'd be sick. I'd be, I'd be down for that. Because this, this will be Alex's first season in Creed Series ever as a full-time driver, actually. Uh, did you receive your new clue for your vacation? Yes, I did. 
But I tell you what, because I was planning on putting that up separately, Zero. I'll let you guys know. So we've got all the clues. We think it's Florence. But I'm going to I'm gonna put it to you guys at a different time. Maybe I'll do it on Discord. I think I did post all the clues on Discord, actually. I think I might have. If you search in general on Discord, you might better find them. I'm pretty sure I did. Your focus is on a win this season? Absolutely. Yeah, 100%. It's, it's, it's a crime that we haven't won a race yet. But hopefully... Hopefully we can we can break that curse. Make a temp temporary clues channel. I, I was going to put something up on Instagram as well because I think that'll be a really cool thing for it. Basically, I think it's going to be Florence. The holiday is only two weeks away now or, or just uh, just over. I think it's um yeah two weeks. This Sunday is when we is when we fly out. So I've said to Carla when the envelope comes through the post in literally a couple of weeks time. Um, I've said open it fine. If it's Florence, just t just tell me yes, because I'm expecting that now. If it's not, just say no. Don't tell me where it is. I want to find out at the airport, because I'd love to like rock up at the airport and just do a, oh my God, we're going here kind of video, you know? And I'll I'll do all that on my Instagram. I normally do do that stuff on Instagram. So make sure you guys follow follow the Insta if you haven't already, because that's where you can, can catch that kind of stuff. Uh, oh, I posted seven clues. Sorry, okay. So I need to post the eighth. All right, I'll do that. Um, Mia, I'm sorry. We need to get this show on the road. So, I've got to move you. I'm sorry. Sorry. Hey. She's not liking this. Sorry, girl. Sorry. Oh, my God, chat. The amount of cat hair on my lap right now is horrendous. Oh, i got to give this rig a good clean. Right. Oh, I got a little cheesecake as well in the meantime. <laughs> right. Um, I think it's time we get the lobby set up. Mm. I'm going to select this. Uh, my, I think my headset's charged. Bosh. Right, hopefully we're good. Hopefully the wheel cam's okay. I was actually setting up the wheel cam, guys, for iRacing. It looks so good in iRacing because the, the wheel was a lot bigger in-game. And I've actually managed to put this wheel over the top of the in-game wheel. It looks so good. Seriously. I need to do a little bit of tweaking with the, with the green screen filter. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do that after the stream tonight. I'm going to make sure that's all ready. It look, it look, it, yeah, it looks awesome. I'm looking forward to, to showing you guys that. Hmm. Um... Guys, update me. I have not watched a single practice session of Australia so far. Obviously, qualifying is, um, I think someone in the chat said it's like nearly 10 hours away. Um, any 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 key takeaways from practice other than Williams, obviously? Are there you know, any surprises? Uh, are Aston looking quick? I, I honestly haven't seen a single thing. It's been really busy for me. Um, and the times that the sessions have fallen, I haven't been able to watch it. Oh, legend, Scott. Thank you, mate. If you want, Scott, if you do want to update it, put um, put PM on the times. Like maybe PM GM, yeah. Maybe like GMT at the start, and then and then just PMs or or twelve. Just start, maybe put twelve PM or something. Hey, what's up, slide? Welcome in, mate. Hope you're doing well, dude. Mercedes hella mid. Oh, yeah, I saw something on Twitter about Hamilton complaining about his car a lot. Um, which is normally nothing new, but Lewis Lewis seemed particularly uh, unhappy with it. So clearly Mercedes are in the mud at Australia. Charles looks very quick. Okay, all right. Hmm. Hmm. What track do we start with? Let's do. <clears throat> let's do. Um, I'm gonna be so mudded. I'm gonna be all over the place on this first race. Let's do Spain and Netherlands as the first two. Lovely. Hooter McHoot face already in there. Love to see it. I'm not ready for Lewis leaving. Well, good, because you got a whole year to prepare for it. <laughs> it's not quite yet. It is going to be... It's going to feel weird, though, seeing him just not in Mercedes 
uh, colors. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Hey, what's up, Skyzy? Skyzy, new teammate. Skyzy, Skyzy, new teammate. Bro, I don't know who my teammate is for next season, but I'm excited, man. I saw Safso's with uh, Alpine. That was announced today. Skyzy, I think Elray is going to be my teammate. But chat, chat, if you were if you were deciding the teammates, who would you put as my teammate to make it like balance in the constructors? Because that is also the key: is that we don't want a situation where it's like. I don't know, let's say Razan and Tom 97, where it's just like, there's no constructors, it's just boring. We want to keep it somewhat balanced. It, it's, it's, you know, sometimes it's not going to be possible. Drivers missing races, that kind of thing. You can't predict that stuff. But um, yeah, from what you've seen, what do you reckon? Chances Razan, Alex Gillen, Ben Daly. Ben's already been confirmed for uh, Ferrari, actually, with Fabio. But I, I'd love to be teammates with Ben. I think that'd be really cool. Skyzy says, how's my teammate doing? I'd love Skyzy as my teammate. That'd be cool. Give me Skyzy, please. Skyzy, do you know if you're going to be with um with Paya? Because I don't know if you guys um request to be together just because obviously uh, both being French and able to talk together in a VC. Because it makes sense if so. <clears throat> would it be safer with Ben as a teammate? Well, yeah, hopefully he wouldn't miss on me as much, but it is Ben. <laughs> so I was with Ben in a VC last night and it was Saf and um, Yorick there, I think. And I can't remember what we watched. Ben on iRacing. No, it wasn't. It was it was Australia. He did like an Australia GP stream. He was doing like sim damage at Australia. Some of you guys might have watched it. I think this was either last night or the night before. Um, and I missed the stream, but I was reviewing the footage. And basically, like, I think Saf was just playing it through from like from like a third person view. And Ben was just running like everyone off the track. I think it was Alex's community event, something like that. And bro was just running everyone run. He was running everyone off the track without realizing, and then his reaction was hilarious. He genuinely didn't realize he was like running basically every driver off. I thought like that sums it up. <laughs> oh, Skyzy, you asked to be split. Oh, that's spicy. Okay, okay, interesting. Well, in that case, mate, I hope you're my teammate. <laughs> That'll be awesome. And we can uh, we can go for a, go for a constructors. I will be missing the first race though, so not ideal. You can be teammates with him at the Nordschleifer. I mean, I'll happily watch him bid it at the Nordschleifer in his car. Going in the Williams with my boy Logan Sargent. Guys, I'm not going to lie. When I went like before I went live today, I was like, do we do we have 19 drivers for tonight and and uh, and out of respect, we retire the Logan Sargent car. <laughs> But I was like, nah, let's let's not deprive one person of racing. I was like, it'd be, it'd be it'd be good for the banter temporarily, and then we'd be like, actually, we should just have twenty drivers. I love my new team though, not my. Oh, you know your team, not my team. Wait, you know your teammate? Hello. I don't know my teammate, dude. Guys, who's your teammate? <laughs> that is controversial. This is where you said my team, my teammate's GB, and I'm like, oh damn, dude, <laughs> that sucks. Bro doesn't love me. We might see each other more often. <laughs> I'm so confused right now. <laughs> Skyzy's playing a playing a secret game right now. Zero awareness from Ben, by the way, says Steven. I mean Yeah, I always thought he was aware. He just he just knew that he was running people off, but I don't know. Some of the incidents yesterday were like, holy crap. He like he there was one where he like it was set to one Australia. 
and he completely killed someone. Like, they're DNF'd, and he, and he didn't even realize. <laughs> oh, I was like, oh, poor guy. What? Excuse me? Uh, well, that's great. Am I live still? Yeah? Yeah, stream's still up. What's going on here, then? Did you guys get it? Steam? Literally, as the race was starting as well. Oh my god, he sent me a DM. Oh, the spicy chat. Do you want to know? Do you want, do you want to know? Do you want to know this guy's his teammate? Because you might recognize them. Nah, you guys don't want to know. I'll let you guys. I'll let. I'll let you guys wait for the announcement. You guys don't want to know. Oh, it has actually reconnected straight away. Well, that was great. Well, I don't know why I did that, but let's let's try again. Let's get warmed up. I'm gonna be all over the place for these uh, first couple races, like I said. Um, yeah, I've been playing iRacing, racing, which is such a different driving style to F1 cars. It's um. Less downforce in general on some of the cars. LMP2 is obviously very fast with, with a lot of downforce. But even so, an F1 car is an F1 car. Um, F1 is, is is a lot of 100% brake, trail braking, 100% throttle, all fairly quickly. Whereas iRacing is being very gentle. And most of the time, you're not 100% braking depending on the type of corner. Like mid to high speed is, is very gentle kind of feathering through the corner. Which I'm not very good at at the moment because, like I said, I'm, you know me, chat. I'm only an F1 creator. So... Um, it's a whole different skill set to learn at, at this point. Which is why I need some more uh, practice on iRacing. I will do more iRacing streams at um, at different points. I, I, you know, I haven't planned any, but after Sebring, uh, I will tell you guys right now, me, Ben, Razin, Yorit, and at least probably a couple others already want to do Nürburgring 24 hours at the end of May. That's not that far away now. Um, that'll be like basically just before the new game comes out, I think. We want to do the Nürburgring 24, so stay tuned for that. If we do end up committing to it, then um, I will obviously uh, I will obviously need to do a lot of practice, so I'll, I'll stream some of that. Is Fernando Alonso your teammate for Grade Series this season? I hope so. I hope so. Maybe I'll have to ask him. Barnsley, by the way, on kick. Just checking in. Love to see it. Um... The scenes between me and him. So, Skyzy, did you genuinely ask to both ask to be uh, to have different teammates? Because, guys, that's that's another thing is that I would have thought we, we'd see a bit of a shake up in this last season because it's only seven races already, only six races for me, um, just because of the F124 game release date, which we know is the end of May. So, uh, you know, we're kind of like, well, we, we've only got time for seven races, so it will be a really short season. By the way, you guys can ready up as soon as you join, just because um, we're, we're just warming up. It's fine, and then we'll, we'll do 25s once, uh, once we've got people in. GB, would you rather a Man United quadruple or an Aston Martin driver constructor double? Ooh. Ooh. I mean, I've seen United win everything. I've followed United all my life. I've seen United win everything. I would love to see United. Oh, I don't know. That's, a, that's actually a really good question. I'd probably have to go Aston because if it's a, if it was if it was just constructors, I'd probably go United. But if you're saying like Fernando Alonso wins the World Championship, for example, and then NASA win the constructors, then I probably would go for that. That would be insane. Oh, wait, GB, you need to restart your game because it says you're offline. Oh, for God's sake, man. All right, fine. Guys, bear with me one second. Jesus. Let me restart. Friggin' game. Can't find the lobby. Yeah, it's not there. Lobby doesn't exist. But apparently it's also because I, I was showing us offline. <clears throat> Let's play without him. Yeah, enjoy. Enjoy. The lobby will not be the same. You will have 50% less crashes without me, and you know it. This is the earliest F1 of release a new game. It's certainly the earliest. I think it's, I think it's the second earliest ever there's 
uh, for an F1 game. I think there was, I don't remember which year. I think it was a while ago, a long time ago, that there was one F1 title list slightly earlier. But yeah, this is very early. And hopefully next year will be even earlier. I don't know that. I've not been told that, obviously. But um, yeah, hopefully this is a trend that we keep seeing because I know why they can't do it, but it would be absolutely insane if like we could get a new game around the time of the new season. Um, licensing and other issues uh, is the reason behind that. But that would be so cool if we could, if we could get that. Because I never buy the argument of like, I, I see so many, I saw so many people on Twitter like, oh, releasing earlier, so it's going to be like even more unfinished, blah, blah, blah. It's like, guys, code masters and like just game developers in general, they're working on like, sometimes they're working on like, like FIFA, let's, let's look at FIFA or EAFC. They're working on like next year's title and possibly the year after at the moment. Like they work on like future game engines, like miles away. They, you have to be super prepared with that stuff. So if they do an earlier release, for me, it's like they, it shouldn't really compromise on the quality of the game. Because they wouldn't set that release date if they, you know, if they, they weren't confident it would be uh, of the right quality. Can I play for 20 minutes? You can play for 21 minutes, 22 minutes, however many minutes you want. Welcome in, Rafix. Pre-season testing in the career modes will be fun in F124. That would be quite cool, actually. Pre-season testing. Would there be much point of it, though? The way the upgrades work? I don't know. I don't know. I don't do enough of uh, my team, I guess, to make the most informed decision on that. But I'm not sure how effective it would be. Or would you? Would you mean like trying different upgrades? Maybe. Yeah, maybe like trying different upgrade paths. Potentially. There's different teams working on different yearly iterations. How people do not understand this is silly. There you go. You said that in much better words than I did. <laughs> much quicker as well. Much less waffle. Uh, once again, welcome in to, uh, to all you guys tuning in, uh, whatever platform you're watching on right now. We're going to do some community races. We're going to do two five lappers with no assist. Just warming up, just chilling. We're going to get some uh, some menu plebs in. Um, so what this will do is filter out um, the guys that are just here to kill everyone and whatever. Um, guys, you can ready up, by the way. We don't, we, whether we've got four drivers in, doesn't matter. We, we're literally just warming up for the first three five lappers. And then um, and then we'll do a 25% after that uh, once once we've got a full, full lobby and everyone is kind of generally from chat or racing seriously. Oh, fair play then, Kaylee. Fair play. Do you think default setups are going to be better? No. they Default setups should should always be understeery and um, unoptimized. That's, uh, that's, that's the definition of it. Default setups should never be good. Like, as in, like, you know, optimal or even close. We don't want it too early between games. Got to recover from the £100 spent for each game. Depends what edition you buy. Or, guys, you can go over to my Twitter and you can win a free copy. I'm not going to... I'm. It's not going to be the only one I do. I, I am going to... I'm going to tell you guys I will give away at least two copies for free. Like, one of them at the moment is literally just liking a tweet and following me on Twitter. And then I'm going to do a randomized draw. That is... That's... That's... um. Coming along quickly. I think I said that closes April 11th. It's the 10th or 11th of April. So I will draw that on stream um, like we normally do. So that's like two to three weeks away. Three weeks away, I think. Uh, yeah, three weeks away. Yeah, Rafix, you can play, mate. You can play. Guys, Any the lobby is open. Anyone and everyone's welcome to join. I'm not going to invite you, though. You got you, it, The lobby is open. If you can't find the lobby, then... Uh, then it's a GG. Be a GV moment if you select the date to draw and he's on holiday. I did. I did think about that when I set the date because I was. I. I, I want to say it's like a Thursday or a Wednesday or something. It is a slightly awkward day, but whatever day it is, I was like, yeah, I should be able to be live on that day. Worst case scenario, I could record a, a clip of me actually doing it. Legit. All right. 
Drive to survive. Oh my god, the feedback's so light compared to my racing. What is... Okay. Well, that's one way to start. I'm going to be a really slow chat. Get myself warmed up to this again. I'll be really, really slow on this uh, opening two races. I'm trying to be as smooth as I can. It's a good thing with iRacing is it teaches you to be so much smoother, but oh, I already feel that. You just get so much less detail on the feedback, it's nuts. I'm trying to like feel the car and the weight through the corner, but you don't feel it anywhere near the same as uh, you do on iRacing. I think it's fourth gear through there. Oh dear. Oh dear, that should be flat. How can I find the lobby? Uh, GB68. Same as you'd find any other lobby. I'm sure someone in chat can help as well. Didn't you start iRacing really recently? Yeah, dude. I had to grind like hell to get my uh, safety rating up in a position to be able to do Sebring tomorrow with the guys. It's testament to how good the brake feels these, day, these days, though, that um, I'm actually able to, you know, okay, I'm not quick at the moment, but it's relatively up to speed. The sign that the, the, the brake change I made recently is good. Well, I tried to fall through there before and it didn't feel right. That's better, nice and flat. There we go. More like it. Okay, DRS is now available. Good evening from Heathrow Terminal 6, Moo. Hello, mate. Hope you're uh, joyriding some planes today. We're getting hunted down by some bouncing hoots. Oh my god. Too fast on the downshifts. Oh Jesus. All over the place. The guys further back are definitely struggling. Oh, that was bad. Wait, how am I up on my last lap? Doesn't feel like I should be. Good job. That was the fastest lap Here come the hoots! I don't know whether you should keep fifth gear for turn one or not. No clue. Not bad. Oh, my word. God, that's wide. It's easy factory that final corner. Okay, you just started the final lap 
Nitro on the charge. Let him cook. Yeah, it feels so comfortable considering. Saying that about warming up, but it's not too bad. No, Nitro! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, I'm an idiot. I tried, I tried the Ben Daily. <laughs> I tried the Ben Daily. I was like, right. Trap position. Let's run him off. Didn't work. That's me being cold on the throttle and he spun it. <laughs> so knock the wood. I'm not sure I want to knock the wood there, Zero. <laughs> It's actually Barcelona as well. Nice boo. <laughs> oh, what's up, Kiki, by the way, mate? Good evening. Good evening. Welcome in. Welcome in, folks. So we're, we'll do one more five lapper and then we're going to start 25s. I'll get you guys voting the tracks tonight. I'm looking forward to tonight because it's been a while since I've properly actually done F1 with you guys. I think I had to cancel last week's community event because of... I um, can't remember what it was now. I was busy. I was away. So we had to, uh, we had to change it, I believe. As I'm getting mixed up. But yeah, I've been looking forward to tonight. Even though it's Australia, I know Australia has its track issues. If you're not familiar in the game, it's got very buggy track limits. Um, and there's also like, there's like a, there's like a random bump in the, in the, in the track heading into the end of sector two, 90 degree right-hander after the, you know, DRS, double DRS chicane, you know what I mean? Into that right-hander. Um, there's like a bump on the inside. So yeah, it's a bit of a, it's a bit of a, Buggy track, it has its issues. You don't really see it in league racing as a result. Um, certainly not in esports. So, but yeah, I know, but it, it's uh, it's a Grand Prix race weekend, so we're gonna try it. We're gonna try it tonight. Oh man, these five lappers really help me improve my driving with no assists. Yeah, we'll only do one more with no assists, and then uh, and then we'll get it back on for you guys. Um, we'll do uh, we'll do Netherlands. I'll put Saudi in the uh, in the track prediction vote. <clears throat> Wait, we said knock on wood, would not shake your wood. I was reading what chat said. What do you mean? Someone said knock the wood. <laughs> Just talking about wood, then you start shaking your cam, then you start shaking under your camera view. Wait, what? Oh, shaking. Uh, okay, I think we're good. Most names I recognize in the lobby as well. Oh, hello, Scott. Guys, watch out for the... So, Scott, you realize there's no assist on as well, mate. Only for one race, but I think you're going to struggle, dude. I'm not going to lie. Have you even got a car? Dude, you haven't select... Scott, why didn't you select a car, mate? You, you haven't got one now. Maybe he's, wait maybe he's waiting for the 25. I will say, guys, if you want to grab a seat... Um, keep trying in this race because I think you're going to see a few people from the main menu quit uh, at the start of this when they realize it's no assist. So 25% um, after this and we'll turn it all back on. Saudi was a mess for me, the last community race. Oh yeah, that was it, wasn't it? I had to bloody cancel that. I had to not cancel it. I, I got taken out by um, some weird stuff going on. I think it was like Gukka overtaking an AI or something when I was telling him not to. And then that just caused all sorts of chaos. Something along those lines. But yeah, I remember I didn't make it to the end. That would, that would have been a good race as well. You shook your drink out of view of the camera. Oh, I see. I see. Yeah, I do it without even without even realizing. Now that makes sense. <laughs> it was priced as AR. Yes, you're right. 
Oh, God. I wish he hadn't said that now. We're getting PTSD. I remember that. Price is AI. Because Price wanted to race. We tried to get him in. And then he had like a default setup or something by the time he got in. Just because of like the game being scuffed. Not my fault that AI can bust it. No, it is your fault for overtaking the AI. I remember. It was like, Gooker, please, I beg, do not overtake the AI. And you overtook it. And then all of a sudden, everyone had to slow down. And then, then the crash happens, like the one. Ready for, uh, for Sebring? Um, no, but I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> I'm ready for Ben and Alex coming over. It's going to be a fun day tomorrow. Oh, fun weekends. Um, but I'm not... <laughs> am I ready for LMP2 at Sebring? Uh, not so much. Where's Zanvort? There we go. Why do they make the default setup so bad they could at least use better wings? Um, well, I mean... Uh, it's just, like it varies per track, right? It just I don't have a problem with it. I like the fact that they they have completely unusable default setups because then it's like pushing you to actually make your own one and find what suits your own driving style. Oh god, <laughs> that was a lot of drivers off turn one. <laughs> Oh, uh, flashback tip. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Just about avoided him and then we get taken out. Brilliant. I think it was uh, the McLaren that got us. I had to dodge Thomas there in the Alpha Tauri and uh, got rear ended by someone into turn three. Oh my. Whoa, I'm here. Thank you. Appreciate it. Great awareness from the Red Bull there. The Red Bull was like, okay, I'll see you on, on the outside. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to just run you onto that curb. There he is. I think he's I think he's a racing line user, to be honest. I reckon he's just struggling. Okay, the start was fine. Let's try and move forward. 12 hour Nordschleifer. So I'm going to do the 24 hour Nord Nordschleifer in May. We are going to do that. And I will, I will be driving for longer than an hour in that. I'll do like a. Maybe like a three hour, four hour synth, something like that. However, many drivers we've got. I think it's fifth gear, final corner. I remember how to drive this track. Oh, I've got to take wife to the pub. No worries, Scott. I only just read that. We're good. Okay, clear. Don't give me a legal. Oh, dear. All right, feeling fairly warm, to be fair. Nine seconds up. <laughs> oh, okay. Holy understeer. Nice. <laughs> right on time. All right, how many more places? Plenty more positions up for grabs on this one. Oh. I'm not comfortable in fifth right now. Who's watching qualifying tomorrow morning? That is a good question, guys. Is anyone going to be staying up or waking up crazy early for it? Let me know which one. I will not be. I will be missing qualifying and recording it because... With uh, Ben and Alex coming over, it's just not going to work. It's going to be going to leave me with either, yeah, it's going to leave me very tired with not much sleep. So I'll record it and then stay off my phone when I wake up, and then uh, watch a watch a recording. Well, that wasn't ideal. Brake boards are gone. That's fine, though, because it's the same for everyone now. Oh, what am I doing? I should turn the car, GB. Oh, I want 50. Oh, 
No, we're not even in the nines, Jesus. <clears throat> Push! Oh, we P9, and we gain him. Recovering from uh, getting taken out twice at the start. Break balls, one and truly gone. McLaren's gone. Wasn't sure whether he goes or not, but tried to risk it. Well, that was a decent final corner. Might have to juice it now. Okay, mate, this is the final lap of the race. Final lap. Yikes. Oh, it's way too early on the brakes. Push. Oh, it's too deep. It's poor. Lap's mudded. And the gap to the car in front is 4.1 seconds. That's not good. No! Oh, it's a slow lap, not even a nine. Damn. Well, feeling warmed up, ready for a 25. Uh, Shan says, I think it'll be an amazing race. I think every circuit should have gravel taps, uh, traps instead of tarmac runoffs. My hot take of the day. I think we were talking about this recently with um, the, new, uh, the new Middle Eastern track. Um, Kidia, if I'm saying that right. Good evening, Barry, by the way. Welcome in, mate. Yeah, the uh, the Kidia, if I am saying that right, um, the the new Middle Eastern track. Uh, I think it's touted for twenty twenty seven. Um, gravel traps around there were the re one one reason why I said I, I like the look of it from the from the concept at least. So I'm actually looking forward to seeing that one. I'd rather it be in like a South Africa or something. But if we are going to get new tracks, then uh, you know, don't give us another street track. Give us a more traditional circuit with some fun. Fun sections, not you know all slow speed where it breaks up the racing. Allow drivers to uh, to stay close and uh, and and punish drivers for for running wide. Can you kick the AI driver? There's no AI drivers, mate. There's no AI drivers. Uh, I haven't seen the practice results, by the way. Who was asking that? Oh, that was uh, that was Shan. Uh, yeah, I take it McLaren are doing quite well in practice then. I think McLaren should do quite well here because they're normally strong in mid to high speed corners, aren't they? Australia's got a lot of those now. I believe so. Um, yeah, guys, we're going to do 25% races now. The assists are going back on. We're going to do 25% races. You guys are going to choose a track. I am going to put Saudi Arabia. I'm going to put Jeddah in the first prediction. Um, YouTube, you want to choose a track? Guys, Twitch, you want to choose a track? What are we saying? Give me a give me a track you guys uh, you guys want me to put in the prediction, uh, in the prediction and poll. Sorry, why do I keep saying prediction? Oh, I was only two tenths off the fastest lap. Damn, that's unfortunate. Saudi any day, Suzuka Brazil. GV, what's your thoughts on Sergeant getting his chassis stolen by Albon? I uh, we talking about this earlier, Jeno, but I personally. Um, I feel bad for Logan. From a driver perspective, I, I feel for him. I really do, because he did nothing wrong. But I understand it. It does make sense. I wasn't like, you know, I didn't wake up angry at the decision or something. But it, it's brutal for Logan Sargent. But I, I, I actually agree with it. I think 
If you're a team like Williams on a really small budget, smaller team, you need every single point badly, especially if it's the uh, difference in position in the championship at the end, where the prize money comes in, then you go with the driver, you go with the statistical highest chance of scoring points. And that is Alex Albon. No question. Uh, Renee with a 32-month legend, dude. I agree too. You agree? What, with the Logan Sargent thing? I mean, what, what's your guys' takes on it? You, do you agree or disagree with what I said? Yeah, I'm all I'm I'm here for a debate. Do you do you think okay, fine, fair play, but you still think it wasn't the right thing to do and Albon should have missed the weekend? Cause if you were James Vowles, would you have done it differently? Would you have uh said, Oh well Albon, you've crashed, you're out, unlucky. Logan's racing. There there are no AI drivers, graphics. There are no AI drivers, mate. Uh, right. All right, make sure you pick your car, by the way. Make sure you pick your car, guys. Jello, don't do it! Jello, don't do it! Someone pick an Aston, damn it! Why are you guys so slow on the Aston? What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? Someone pick the Aston. Oh, for God's sake, Jello, I literally hate you. All right, we don't get a pit stop. That's fun. <laughs> For me, it's just a way of saying go and clear out your office at the end of the year. If I was if I was Logan, as long as I got my race bonus, I'd be happy. So hey, Jack would be like, I, I don't care about the racing. Give me the money. I, I care about the money. <laughs> oh, Renee says, I agree with the fact that I suck at Sebring. Yeah, mate, honestly, dude, I've, uh, I have i do not really, I, I will suck at Sebring, but I don't even know how I suck. Like, I think, I think my problem with iRacing in general, is that I drive it like an F1 car, where I'm just being too late on the brakes and being too aggressive on the pedals in general. Regardless of late braking or whatever, I'm just being too aggressive. I need to control the weight transfer a lot smoother, um, which I'm aware of, which is a good thing. But then to break that habit and then to drive so differently in different cars is, is, a, is a tough thing to to master. So that's kind of where I'm at at the moment. My pace will be be off and just trying to trying to learn how to how to be as smooth as I can. Um, kick him. Uh, kick Jeno. Uh, sorry, guys. Um, I forgot to put the uh, prediction up. Right. Um, Kaylee, by the way, says it's the correct uh, decision long term, um, but incredible, unjust, and unethical. I'm of the belief Logan doesn't deserve a seat, but he has one, and this treatment is out of order for me, especially when it's Williams Clownery that's made that it's making them have to do this. That's a very good point at the end. It's it's nobody's fault but Williams. Yes, Albon crashed, and yes, that is his fault. I, I assume it's his fault, not like a car failure. From what I heard, he got on the curb and lost the rear or whatever. Anyway, um, uh, Williams didn't have a spare chassis, which is absolutely on them. So Logan Sargent getting punished as a result of it is just an unfortunate, uh, yeah, unfortunate situation. Um, uh, no. Thank you for the follow, by the way. Welcome in. Uh, Renee, once again, I appreciate the resub, bro. I, I do appreciate that. 32 months is insane. Um, let's get this, let's get this, uh, vote up. Sorry. What are we going to go for? We get, guys, I need tracks from you guys. I'm doing Saudi as one of them. Saudi Arabia. I need one from YouTube. What are we saying? Barry, or anyone on YouTube? What are we saying? Let me know what track you want in the poll. What are we saying? I'm not going to do Australia because we're driving that later. Uh, what are we saying? What are we saying? What are we saying? Vegas. Saudi Jelly. Saudi's already in it. Another track, Barry. Another track. I'm d I'm picking... Oh, I oh my God. I've seen multiple Las Vegas in, in Twitch chat. Okay. All right. Vegas it is. You guys, uh, you guys choose death. A track that you hate, like Qatar or, or Kota. Nice. <laughs> Jello, Jello, I literally hate you. Right. Guys, poll is up. Press one in chat for Saudi. Press two for Vegas. Or press three for Hungary. 
One, two, or three. One for Saudi, two for Vegas, three for Hungary. That is the first track we're doing. Um, I've definitely changed the settings. I will make sure that it's all correct. Give me, give me a moment. Oh, Barry, Barry said, Barry said, back here at the worst time. I would have done it as well. Oh, sorry, mate. I'll do back here for you next time. Just remind me, remind me. Oh, what are we saying? What are we saying? We got votes in uh, on YouTube. The first one I saw was a one, so I'm pressing one. Hey, what's up, John? When do you plan on seeping in between this stream, Australia Quality and Sebring 12 Hour? I'm not going to watch Quality, mate. I won't be up for it. I'm going to record it because um, Ben and Alex are coming over and we're going to do the stint together, basically, uh, from 4 o'clock to 7 o'clock, I think, an hour each. So that is the plan at the moment. I'll record Quality and then just watch it in the morning. Try and avoid my phone. Avoid you mofos that like to ping me and, you know, troll me. And I'm like, oh, I don't want to see the results. And then, like, at least three people will DM me like, oh, my God, GB, this happens. Uh, cheers. Appreciate it. Uh, realistic. Why is the weather not right? Uh, uh, random one, by the way, guys. But uh, John Bin in chat reminded me. I'm, I'm. It's not confirmed yet, but I'm hoping I might be um, doing next week's community event at the Aston facility. Live streaming from the rigs. I mean, obviously, we did a very brief BTEC stream before, but it'd be nice to rock up for the day and um, and kind of get things set up properly and and do some online racing with you guys. Hopefully, that is the plan. Uh, yeah, when when that happens, I'm not quite sure. Just trying to finalise at the moment. What are we saying on the track, guys? One, two, or three. Let me know what track we want to do. One, one is Saudi Arabia. Two is Las Vegas. Three is Hungary. At the moment, Hungary is winning by four votes. Um, I was gonna. Did I press one in chat for Saudi? I think I did. I think I already did. Did I do it? I'm gonna do it again just in case. That would that that's from that's from the first YouTube vote. So there we go. Yeah, I already did. It didn't count. Cool. <clears throat> press two for race strategy. No, 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 guys. Press press one if you. Sure, a legend. Totally agree. Sleep then watch catch up Australia, says Barry. Is anyone else doing the same thing, or is it like, guys, guys, press one in chat if you're uh, if if you're not going to watch it live and you're going to wake up and watch a pre-recording. Let me know. Press one in chat. Oh, we got a couple more Jetta votes coming in. <laughs> What's up, George? Welcome in, mate. <laughs> oh, very good. Right, the poll is done. It is going to be hungry as our first race. Jeno right now is dancing around his living room. He is he's calling the family. He's spreading the news. It is time for hungry. A track I have not driven for about ten decades, a hundred years. I think we're good. I'm pretty sure I've done all the settings right, but let me know if I haven't. I think we're I think we're chilling. <clears throat> Skipping this weekend too early in the morning. I think the problem as well, Nick, is that I'd be a lot more inclined to scuff my sleep schedule for F1. But it's just a fact for a lot of us that there, there's no fight for the win. And there might be interesting things happening further back. Obviously, you know, I'm I'm supporting Aston and I want I really want Fernando and Lance to do well, but like if there's no fight for the lead, it's you know on this kind of weekend where it's like, okay, if I watch it, I'm compromising, you know, my daytime for both days. I'm just like nah. I'd rather not. <laughs> you know? I will I but yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I'll watch it, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna compromise my, my my sleep schedule for the weekend. Yeah, I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to sound like a. You know, I'm not trying to sound all depressing, but <laughs> that's just the way I look at it. Maybe you guys are the same. Maybe you're not. Only upside is Red Bull's fourth on race pace. Absolute cap. That is. That is absolute cap. If Red Bull were fourth on race pace, um. I will eat this steering wheel in front of you guys uh, on Monday. I will eat the whole thing. I will get a knife and fork out and I will eat it. If they are fourth on race pace, I will eat it. I guarantee you 
they are at least half a second clear on race pace. Because it's normally the opposite. In qualifying, we're like, oh, wow, okay, Ferrari look like the same pace as Red Bull, or Ferrari are only two tenths of Red Bull, or whatever. And then, but we all know that the Red Bull always goes for race pace, and then it's just clear. If I wake up, I'll 100% fall asleep before the formation lap ends. Watch it drunk like you like show. <laughs> what? At 5 a.m., mate. Or 4 a.m. even. Take a shot every lap. <laughs> Max leads. <laughs> That's a dangerous game. Shot of water, mate. I'll still go for about four toilet breaks throughout the race. In Saudi, Williams were level with Mercedes. In practice. Uh, but that's Mercedes. Mercedes are apparently scuffed anyway, right? Ah, uh, let me... What, work! Let me do my setup! Hey, I'm going to restart the lobby if I can't do this. Why won't it let me select my freaking setup? I'm pressing the button for it! Oh my god! <laughs> oh! I'm in heart. Oh god. Right, I'm starting from the back. Jesus, that was close. I don't know what to do for strap now either. We are so going to have someone hit us now. Here we go. I can feel it. The house is coming. Oh, there's damage everywhere. <laughs> How is there already a VSC before? So oh my God, someone's not even breaking. Who is that? There's a Hass there. Who is the Hass? I don't recognize the name. That's never a good thing. Guys, guys, you've got to give that position back, mate. We're under safety car conditions. And you oh, my God, there's damage under a safety car. This is staggering. This is this is. Oh, okay. Think Scott's <laughs> Scott. <laughs> Scott, what's going on? How have you just spun under a safety car? <laughs> Oh, no, Scott. <laughs> that was not cooking. <laughs> oh, dear. A bit of Tommy sauce? Wait, what do you mean, Barry? And what have I missed? Let's try and get this delta down a little bit if we can. Guys, we are going to box the medium straight away. Okay. That's one way to make a move, chat. That's a stunning overtake, and we're up to P14. Bro Satnav said right on a left hander. And just like that, we're through. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's going on. It's such a bizarre start. I nearly spun then as well. I don't feel like I'm ready. Oh. That's close. <laughs> oh, I'm not going to hold him up. That 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 hurts enough, doesn't it? All right. Wait. P10. How are we P10? Was there that much wing damage in front? We ever took a lot in the pits. We just gained through, yeah, four positions in the pits. Okay, well, we're up to P10 and we've done our pit stop. And I'm pretty sure some drivers in front have not boxed. So that puts us in a pretty decent position. The only thing is I don't really know how to drive this track at the moment. Well, I, you know, well, I kind of do, but... I've forgotten where the optimal braking points are. Yeah, apparently now we gain positions when we box. I don't know what's happened there. I think drivers around us must have just had really slow pit stops. Maybe double stacked or uh, or had damage. I don't know. Very weird one. I think tyre deck here is very high. For the amount of laps there are, I think I think tyre deck's quite high. So, could be a little bit slidey at the end. We've got purple sector two, chat. We are flying. We are flying. 
The top seven nearly all have penalties. Wait, do they still have penalties? The one to seven say that. Interesting. Okay, so only three drivers in front. Oh, sorry, two drivers in front. Or uh, have have boxed. Wow. Me fastest lap. Me fastest lap. Me fastest lap. Oh, that's the fastest lap in my book. Someone tried to overtake in the pits. Well, if you go in really slowly, then I don't blame them. It just depends, though. If, I mean, if you're just diving right to the line or rear-ending, whatever, then that's obviously dumb. But some people do go ridiculously slowly into the pits. I'm talking like they're doing pit limiter speed like 200 meters early, in which case you're asking for someone to just send it around the side of you. I would do the same. Although it is under safety car, isn't it? So, <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't think you're allowed to do that. No idea about fuel, by the way. I'm assuming in a 25% we're fine for fuel, but I actually don't know how much this track burns. I am burning some now. Oh, Barry, you're all about what I eat my steering wheel. Yeah, well, if I'm allowed to have some ketchup with it, if, if Red Bull are the fourth pace... Are, are, are the fourth quickest car on race pace. I will get some ketchup and I will eat my steering wheel in front of you guys. How about that? Scott has retired from the race. Scott has indeed not cooked this race. Jay Chelsea, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Welcome in. Unfortunately, you support the worst club in world football, but I appreciate you. Hopefully that's just your uh, surname and you don't actually support the club. <laughs> no offense to Chelsea fans. As you might have guessed, I'm not a Chelsea fan. Alright, let's go. It's time to cook. Going to be boss-ass bowling turn one. Especially if these guys have stayed out. They're going to be... This is going to be chaos, I think. I think the start of the grid... Oh, the front of the grid is going to be... Kind of out of control. Let's find out. Going to take a really wide line. Final corner. Okay, that wasn't ideal, clearly. Okay, clear. Oh, nice, he's running low wings. Oh, this car's all around us. My God, man, that alpha was all over the... How's he got 10 seconds? Very good. You can see that one coming. <laughs> okay, Sorry, that's illegal. That was scary. Oh my god. Oh, well, that's wide. Slow through that. Warning there. You can go so late on the brakes that corner and still make it stick. All right. We've climbed up nicely. So loose on that final corner. So the two in front are boxed. Well, they got through very quickly. What is going on? <laughs> what am I seeing? and get these guys in front. That's the aim. Don't know if we'll be able to. Oh, nice just going through. Never mind. Oh, nice just going off. <laughs> I was I was uh, having a yield swim there. I used a bit of a battery because I didn't realise he was going for it. And then uh, I'm happy for Knight to, to go first to give the DRS. He's obviously going to be quicker. Where's our teammate? Where's Jeno? Oh, God. Oh, Jeno's behind. Yeah, I'm slow. I'm losing time. At least I think I am. It's never been a good track for me in uh, recent games. 
Nitro has gone wide for the better exit. He'll fly past now. Try and stick with Nitro if we can. What we want to do. Jack's looking quick as well. Oh. Oh, you guys are going side by side. That's good for us. I'll try and sail him. Guys, out of interest, is the music a bit too loud? Nothing's playing right now, but... I feel like it's a bit too loud. I can hear it while I'm driving. I wonder whether the McLaren's got slight damage. He's fallen off that Mercedes a lot. Oh, boy. There's one thing we know about... Oh, Gukka is it? He knows he... We know he likes to fight very hard. I'm really off on the traction. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 2.2 seconds. Go on, get him, Nitro, get him, get him. Got no battery, very good. Where's Gukka going? Just about made it back into the racing line there. Oh, that's not good. Got to try to see with Nitro if we can. Pace is slowly getting better. Oh, big slide. Round about now that I remember that my fan's not on. Ugh. Oh, I didn't switch on. Oh, a little gap on Gukka. That was slow. Bubbly is flying at the moment, and we're going to struggle to stay with him. I'll try and keep this pace up. Lost time through there. Got grass on the tyres as well. And just like that, DRS has gone. Come on. No! Oh my god. That was crazy close. I'm kind of keeping up with Bubbly, but Nitro just re is too quick. Not ideal. Oh my God, chat, I've got no battery. One more and we're in trouble. Oh, no. Uh, Bubbly's not even getting away, but Nitro's just so fast. Jeno's catching really quick as well, he'll be honest.
Well, that's not good, chat. Sloppy lap. Oh. I need my fan on, dude. I'm sweating like crazy. This is why we don't use Hungry, by the way, because that's it now, isn't it? We can't get a safety car. 18 laps. 18 laps of pure sweat. It's, it, if, on a wheel, this track is nuts. It's, it's force feedback is just... It's crazy. I, I'm, I need it on the next race. I'm sweating like mad. Go on. Keep fighting. Keep fighting, boys. That's what we want. That's what we want, chat. Nitro's gone P1, which is not good. RIP DRS for good. It's close, it's close. Oh, it's not going to happen. Mia's here trying to jump up. No DRS. GG rip. Get me in seventh already. Oh my god. Oh, Mia did not enjoy that. But yeah, we do need a Mia cam, don't we? I'm like, wait, what was that? Guys, did you see that? Am I tripping? Was there a car there? I just saw debris flying out of the barrier. Or was that a car? Did you guys see that? Tell me I'm not seeing things. That was... It was definitely uh, debris coming from that barrier. Oh, guys, this is why we don't do hungry. What is this race? The guys who didn't pit as well are so screwed. Oh, good. Debris. Well, I remember I said debris before and I got stick for it, so I'm saying debris. <laughs> All right, Jenna's going through. I'm not going to fight it. I'm cruising at this point, chat. Dead track. Dead track. Just like Creator Series here is dead. Get it gone. Get it in the bin. I like watching uh, the IRL racing here. Be amazed if we don't get a penalty, by the way. Do what car you driving next season? I know, right? It's almost like every other driver is being told in the background. I, w I was saying to Saf and Ben last night, I was like, nah, I'm not, I'm not bothered. I want to, I want to wait for the announcement. I want to see who it is. I reckon it's El Ray. I reckon El Ray is my teammate. Bring back the season three lineup. That's my, that's my prediction. Skyzy uh, in chat was saying he asked for uh, him and Persia not to be together, uh, together anymore. To mix it up. Here goes our teammate. Gonna go for a switch back to just for some fun, why not? Well, that DRS he is clear. Oh. Send it! Well, that's interesting. 
I was not expecting that. I thought I thought we were done. I thought we were done. We had a VSC and a safety car. Oh, he never asked. Okay, it was capping. It was a chat earlier, actually. I was like, Sky Z, teammate, teammate. <laughs> uh, right. Soft tires for four laps, Skies. This has turned into a five lap race almost. A standard five lapper is what we're almost doing. All right. Uh, should be should be interesting. Let's go for it. All right, here we go. This is going to be spicy then. We got a really good launch. What a start. Depending from the Ferrari down the inside. Oh, siding on the exit, trying to get that power down. Why is my battery muddy, bro? It's so bugged. All right, that was a good, uh, that was a good start. Get off me, Jello. Leave me alone. Gonna say these are cold tires, but of course they're not. Should be, uh, yeah, they're mid 90s. Oh, I've got a cat hair on my face. Surely this is Geno's race to to, uh, to win now. Nitro is flying. I'm my best to stay with him. Dear, that's horrible. Push. Oh, my battery's so muddied. I don't know why I'm using it. I'm not going to be able to say it, not just DRS. Bit too much on the brakes there. Four tenths of Jello, who's just cruising. He knows I'll have no DRS. I'll be a sitting duck when that does hit. Two laps of DRS uh, at the end of the race. You got ice cream? W. Oh dear. Come on. Oh, it's too quick. Far too quick. He has won the race. Unless Jenna overtakes me like now. She needs to do the horrible final corner. Okay, Jenna burning everything? No. I'll have DRS next lap. I reckon Jenna might have damage or something. Not looking forward to that next straight, guys, at the head of a DRS train. Will everyone be streaming Sebring separately on their accounts? Uh, I believe so, yeah. Razin's one of them as well in chat. Razin will be driving. Razin, are you still doing the last stint, mate? You saw the stint. I, I, I just pasted that from our uh, from our chat. If that's wrong, let me know because I'll, I'll update the command. Oh, come on. That's what happens when I start talking. Are they all in your rig? Yeah, yeah. So Alex, Ben are coming over tomorrow. They'll be staying over tomorrow night. We'll be, uh, we'll be doing Sebring, hopefully from about four o'clock. So we're going go-karting and we're on track at half two. We haven't booked a long session. It's only a 30-minute session, so I am hoping that we'll be back in time okay, and we'll be okay for 4 p.m. Okay, I might even finish P4 or 5. Oh. 
What track? Sebring. It's a 12 hour endurance race in iRacing. Oh, it was last lap, wasn't even paying attention. Definitely could have held that position. Well, that was a warning, surely. If he gets a penalty, I'll be kicking myself. Oh, that was a big lockup. I don't know what happened there. Mia's back again for the third time. We're doing cat. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They're, they're all in my rig. No, all, all the guys aren't in my rig. Literally, <laughs> just Ben and Alex. Ben and Alex are around tomorrow. The other guys are, will be streaming their own POV. So I think. Judging by those stints, I think Tom was before me, right? So you'll be able to see Tom, for example, shooting before me. Um, and that will be... Uh, and and that, will be, that will be then feeding into our stint. Wait, Scott. Hang on. The, the schedule's wrong. Wait, is that... Or did Brad's an update? Why is Tom four to five now? Oh, no, no, never mind. Okay, it's because it's... Yeah, I need to try and restructure that. 4 to 5, GB Ben Alex, 5 to 6, GB Ben Alex, 6 to 7. Yeah, basically from 4 to 7 is, is me, Alex, and Ben tomorrow. What track are you racing the carts at? It's, uh, it's a local track in Newport. Local track. It's just an indoor one, which, um, which we're allowed to bring GoPros on, actually. So I will bring a camera and get some footage. See me, uh, see me running rings around uh, Gillen and Ben. It's a little bit luck of the draw in the, in the carts. I'm not going to lie. I went before with George Morgan and um, I was one and a half seconds slower in the second stint that we did. We did two stints. Second stint, I was, I was slower um, because my cart had like throttle like delay, basically. Like you guys, I'm sure some of you have seen it before. You put your foot down on a cart and because it's like, I don't know, excessive wear and tear or whatever it is. Um, it's just it's just loads of throttle like input delay. Is Ben gonna pull you out of the rig when your stint is over? I'll probably be having to pull him and Alex out to be honest, because I'm worried they're gonna break my green screen. I'm gonna literally, guys, guys, when they turn up, I am gonna give them a live in-person tutorial on how to get in and out of this rig. Because you see me struggling a little bit getting in and out. It's it's not actually a struggle, but it's because of how I've put the green screen on that if you lift your knees up, it will just rip it off. So you need to kind of like shimmy your leg out the side and then kind of get out like you would in a go-kart. In a go-kart, you kind of step onto the seat and drop yourself in. In this, you step over the seat and drop, your, drop yourself in. Are they taller than you? No, uh, I'm, I'm taller than Ben and Alex. I think I'm... Yeah, no, I am taller than Alex. Definitely taller than Ben. I'm huge, guys. I'm, I'm really tall. I'm a, I'm a whopping 5'10". Which, um, if you want that in metric, if you're in the EU, that's like over 200 centimetres. That's at least like 300 centimetres in my book. Right, next race. Let's get a pole up. Come on. Let's choose the next track. Let's get a... I want a spicier race of that. That was a... I suppose it was a decent ending. I just I never have any pace at Hungary. Struggle there. So what track should we do? Uh, George on YouTube says uh, Austria. So I'm putting Spa in Austria and one more. China. All right, done. Guys, poll is up. There we go. One for Spa, two for Austria, three for China. One, two, or three. Easy. One, two, or three. Come on. Choose a track and then we'll full send it. We've got Australia coming up. Um, we've got two more 25s, and then we will full send it into Australia. Short qualifying, 50% race, guys. If you haven't signed up for it, go to the uh, Discord. Get your name on the sign-up uh, list. In fact, Nitro, would you be able to copy the message in, please, mate? Sorry, I, I always forget that these days. I always forget that. And yeah, once again, if you're just tuning in, this is our community race night. So if you want to join myself and the guys in the lobby and uh, drive with us, then uh, please feel free. It's first come, first serve. Um, the lobby's full at the moment, but there are spaces coming up. 
There are still a few names that I don't recognize, which is never a good thing when it comes to racing. So just be warned. I already know Cubic Word is a very dirty driver. So just be warned that, yeah, you know what to expect. I can't remember if Cubic Word intentionally takes people out or not, actually. I, I, I'll see. But I don't really care. I have to, uh, I have to see. What well, Hungry Race was interesting. Yeah, I saw you were behind me, mate, at one point, and then, and then you weren't. One, two, or three, then chat for the next race. Uh, George, everyone on YouTube, press number two. So I will press number two for you, mate. Bosh. Yeah, so sorry. I wish this poll extended to other platforms, but if you just for clarity for George, uh, Barry, whoever else on YouTube as well. Um, unfortunately, the it doesn't let me... Unfortunately, it doesn't let me uh, uh, extend it to other platforms. It's only on Twitch. So when I say one, two, or three, it's whatever. You, if you press one, two, or three in Twitch chat, it will uh, it'll add on the poll. But where you guys have been pressing a number on YouTube, I've, I've been... Whatever the first number it is that I see, I, I vote for it myself. No worries, Scott, mate. <clears throat> Honestly, though, like, if, if that's the way you feel, that's absolutely fine. But for clarity, if, you, if, you're, if, if you're not, you know, if, if you're not very confident on the game, or you are, you know, if, if you're an esports driver watching um, every now and again, we've, we've obviously got esports guys in chat. I don't mind if you want to sign up. It's absolutely fine. It's a community event for a reason. If that means we get an esports driver or if that means we've got someone that's learning the game, that is that is what it is. That's uh, that's up to you to try and keep it clean and um, for everyone else to drive their own race. What's the vote saying at the moment? Austria's ahead by two. Guys, one reminder, China is not going to win this, I don't think. I think China is out of this. But if you want Spa or Austria, it's one or two in Twitch chat. One or two if you haven't voted already. Uh, where's my, my scroller gone? There we go. That's better. There we go. Oh, it's tied up. Oh, it's tied up. We're, we're tied between Spa and Austria. Guys, next vote wins. One or two for Spa and Austria. I'm ending the... Uh, whichever one I see is on 12, I'm ending it. Whichever one I see on 12, I'm ending it. Done. Austria. Austria, GG. GG's to Austria. Another 18 lap race coming up. Oh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Make sure you join the iRacing team, by the way, before you head off tonight. Apparently not in yet. I don't even know how to join that stuff. I've, this is the thing. Like, I don't know how swapping stints work. I don't know how any, how any of this works. I don't think I've seen any anyone say it. So at the moment, I'm fully winging everything. Uh, now you said that though, Razin, I will. I, I'm not gonna when I'm when I'm done on stream. I'll probably head head on to iRacing, mate. So if you're about in the VC. Same with the other guys, then um, I'll hop in for a bit, most likely. I do need to do a few bits before the guys come over tomorrow, but should be all right. To, I, I need to do a run, man. I've not done a single race run for in the LMP2 at Sebring, like with other traffic, other classes. So I need to do it. Uh, oh, I need to get rid of the pole. Right, Austria won. There we go. Next race is Austria then, folks. Thank you for putting the message, Nitro Legend, dude. <clears throat> uh, a few months ago, I was an idiot and killed you in one of your open lobbies and blocked my EA, so I can't join anymore. Could you unbound me, please? I've improved a lot since then with my racing standards. Uh, I mean, yeah, if it was a genuine mistake, sure, I don't mind. Uh, I'm, I'm not bothered. I only... Uh, I, I block anyone that, that I think just purposely, intentionally tries to take me or anyone out. Um, so whatever you did must have been bad to, <laughs> to have been on that list. But that's fine, mate. Uh, uh, it's all good. I will, uh, I will un unblock you. What's your What's your EA name? Is it same as Twitch? Uh, Tom, thanks for the follow, by the way, mate. Welcome in. Do you be banning someone? I know it's a pretty it's a pretty rare occasion, but I've always done that. I've I've actually got quite a big ban list, I think, on the EA account just because ever ever since the friends list was a thing. I, I just I just got into a habit of if there was someone intentionally taken out, I would ban them and then it's obviously keeps track on the list. But they're always just like, you know, they're normally like bot console accounts that just join so she's just absolutely eat the whole lobby. It happens. 
Bigfoot. Oh god, I recognise that name. That's okay. That's not good that I recognise it. All right. Yeah, no worries, mate. <clears throat> All Gucci. Am I on the screen? Oh, wrong one. Right, give me the hard time. Oh, we got rain in the race. Oh, we got rain. Oh god, do I have a wet setup? Oh, I don't think I have a wet setup. Oh, I don't think I have a wet setup. Oh boy. Uh, we could be in trouble here. Oh boy. I'm not sure what I've done is a good idea. But we'll find out. Jack, this race has got rain. This is going to be good. Unless we get a red flag, then it's scuffed. Please don't cause red flags. I like you on soft tyres. Oh, God. Okay, this car's out already. Could be a safety car here. There it is. There's the VSC. Easy does it, guys, behind. Easy does it. Easy does it. I tell you what, we probably got saved by that VSC because turn three is normally chaos. And we're at the back, so maybe we would have been okay, but that VSC actually might have helped us. What's up, Checo? Welcome in, mate. Yeah, I completely missed that rain, Hydro. So uh, this should be a spicy race. Should be a good finish. Another reason why we love Austria. So GD's to everyone that voted Austria. Uh, what the hell? What's going on? Oh, was, is it Cubic? Cubic taking people out, Jello? Oh, wait, that's not, that's not Jeno. I see. Right, our teammate is eating people on purpose, I see. Got it. And he's not getting illegal overtakes either. Oh, he's not, he's also not boxing. How's he not getting illegal overtakes? What is, what is bro doing? Okay, VSC ending. We're going green. Maintain positive delta until the green But that delta's flag. disgusting, by the way. What is going on? This is this is absolutely nuts. Watch our teammate kill us. <laughs> no wing looking straight on speed. <laughs> what the hell is that? How is he so quick on the exit? What is this? What am I seeing? Oh, I'm so going to get killed by him. He is an absolute menace. I think he needs to go, doesn't he? I think he probably needs to go. Oh, Jesus. All right, come on. Let's crack on. We need to get onto the back of these guys. Make sure you'll have DRS. Go for it. On softs as well. Let him cook. Why am I third gear? Go, Nitro, go! Be free! Chat, I'm not going to lie. My wings, I hope they're cooking in the wet because they're not cooking in the dry. But I already knew that. It looks like rain is inbound and we're expecting it in around five minutes. Woo! Five minutes until the rain. Rain is coming very early. Okay. We like that. It is only approximate forecast. Oh, I'm not sure about that line. Okay, driver's off, left, right, and center, sir. Up to B11. This is going to be messy, isn't it? Okay, William's going very slow. Got Logan Sergeant in front. Logan, where are you going? Don't fight me, Zero. Don't fight me. Nice move. Good job. It's a good exit. Okay, the safety car is Another safety the car. car is oh, this is this is the last one. Uh, guys, weather report. 
Weather report, weather report, weather report, weather report. Chat? Really? Inters? What's the giant hoots going to do? See, if I was Alex Gillen right now, I could have some nice software to tell me when the rain is going to drop. But unfortunately, I don't have the facilities for that. I'd love to know when it's actually going to rain. Any, any thoughts? Any, any Alex Gillens in chat want to tell me when it's raining? Risk it. Nitro did it, so I followed him. I don't know if that's the right call. Oh my god, bro just got a double overtake. That was insane. That was insane. Jack just got a double overtake. Okay, go, go, go. Perfect job from you and the crew. I gotta say, chat. I don't know if this is the right call. I don't know if this is the right call. Oh boy, <laughs> there's a lot of inters. I know it's not inters right now. We are banking on rain. It did say rain was falling in the next five minutes, but is he debating us? I don't know. Later, welcome in. Hope you're doing well. Happy Friday. Would you have boxed here later? What are we saying? I, I'm, not, I'm not too sure about this. Okay, Chat's down. laughing. This is typical chat. I ask you guys what to do. You say inters, and then you laugh at me. <laughs> Chats rats. <laughs> the tires will be getting murdered, though, while the track stays like this. We've just got to really feather these tires. Do not put any load through them. Mind you, we still got to catch the safety car. What are these guys doing? Oh, rears don't. No, 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 no. Rears, come on, stay with me. If the rears get worn and the fronts don't, we're going to be sliding like hell. This is why Alex doesn't read chat. <laughs> Look, he's behind you. I know, it's Hooter McHoot face. He's cooking. And we're racing before the community event. Yeah, one more 25 after this, mate. One more one more 25, I think. We'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. If we, can, if we can do another, we'll do another. Oh, wait. I didn't even see that he boxed. Damn it. I'm an idiot. Back, mate. Oh, I was not paying attention then. The Come on! Do not go into the end of this lap. We are all screwed. We're all screwed. Weather report. That has to be now, surely. Oh my god. These these inters are going to get destroyed, though. They're going to get destroyed, chat. They are going to get destroyed. Oh, and it's in this lap. Oh, we're going to die. Chat, we're going to die. Rain, come on! It's, it is getting more and more grey. Come on, come on, come on. We need more rain. We need more rain. Please rain, please rain, please rain, please rain. Come on, come on, come on. I can feel it getting more moist. I am getting more moist. Everything is more moist. Come on. You can see the track is starting to get a little bit like it is sensing rain, right? <laughs> come on, please. Move. Freaking AI. Oh boy. All aboard the struggle bus. Oh boy. Oh boy. We need the rain to fall now. No locking up. I just need to be smooth. That's all we need to do. We cannot. Guys, it's already 8% wear on these tires. Oh boy. We need it to rain right now. Oh god. No lockups. 
No wheel spin, no lockups. Come on, 9%. Come on. I might see. Oh, it's raining! It's raining, it's raining, it's raining! Oh my god, it's raining. Oh my god. We might be big brain here, guys. I'm driving slowly on purpose, by the way. If you're wondering, GB, you're losing the guys ahead. I am. I am taking this super easy because, trust me, tire wear will be crucial come the end of the race. These tires are already on 10%. I'm just trying to be as kind to them as I can. I know Nitro's just sitting behind as well. He's not looking to do anything impatient. Come on. Show me the money, chap. Show me the money. Come on, where's the monsoon? We need a tsunami here. 14%! 14! Oh, God, I need to take it easier. That was way too much wear, that lap. What the hell? 14%? It did like 6% in one lap. What am I seeing? Oh, this tyre is disgusting. If it keeps wearing at this rate, we're going to be struggling because fronts will be way less worn than the rears, so we'll be sliding loads. Contact in front. I just spun my rear tyres, 16%. Every time I spin the wheels, it's brutal. If you're running traction control or ABS in these conditions, you're loving life. Oh my god, the tyre wear is absolutely brutal. Chat, I'm not going to lie, it, I think it made more sense to stay out. Because it's still not wet. And the, 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 the amount of time gain is going to be nuts. The question is, do we box? Do we box again for fresh tyres? Because it will be wet. And there won't be a safety car, remember, so... Oh, God. Oh, my. That was very early. You didn't mean to just miss all that, but... I broke on the 100 ball, which I thought was fine. 25. Oh, God. These tyres are horrible, chat. These tyres are horrible. Yellow flag. Oh, chat. The rain is not coming at all. We have done the opposite of Cook here. We have frozen. Box for worn tyres. Box for fresh tyres, says chat. You reckon we should box again? To avoid the Williams there or whatever car that was. My God, man. How is it still not wet? Get wet. Come on. The tyre deck is disgusting. It is absolutely disgusting. Tire temps. Uh, 90 degrees front and rear. Which is okay. Oh, I'm sliding everywhere. I think we have to box, guys. I think we have to box. We're, we're way too slow now. It's ridiculous. This tire wear is absolutely insane. This is the risk of boxing early when it's dry in this game is that Inter's just disintegrate. That's what it stands for, disintegrate. I don't know why I'm using battery, but anyway, let's get to the pits. In we go. It might be an L strat. I'm going to try it. That was way too early. All right. Right, now we see. So Jeno box last... La Wait, did he? Where is he? Where is Jeno? Oh, he's ahead. He said teammate was boxing. Okay, I'm confused. Safety car will come out next. No, we've used them all up. We've had two. Otherwise, I would, uh, I would stay out for sure. I don't know whether this is the right call. We'll find out. Not many laps to uh, put the times down, but we should be quick. Mm -hmm. 
it's, wait, it's still D Oh my god, it's still DRS. Are you serious? That's brutal. Red flag it can be. Oh my god, if it's a red flag. Okay, the stewards have now there we go. DRS. DRS is now disabled. Bruh. Oh, we got a plebby. We got a pleb. We got a plebby back marker. Let's fight really hard for this P11 with your penalty. Let's do it. This is the battle that chat wants to see. This is what everyone is waiting for. Who can finish P11? You could argue I should have played it safe and maybe not gone for that, but I need to get past him. He's slow. I'll burn on your battery, please. Thank you. Other drivers are boxing now. Right, he'll be fast on the straights. We need to uh, break earlier than him and get him on the exit. Oh, fair play. He kept that very clean. Move down. Right, let's move on. Probably should be on 55 diff right now, but we'll chill with it. Oh, I keep thinking that's Jeddo. It's not. Does it really make a different time? <laughs> it was good times. Alex Gillen at China. Who could forget? Not ideal, not ideal, not ideal. Why my third gear? Five second penalties ahead, but look at the gap, bro. Oh my god. Right, how much should we close it? We just need to get our head down now. Yes, I was second gear. And what? Ten percent wear on the tires already, guys. For the front so in the seventies. That's concerning. switch there. Uh, we have not gained on these guys in front at all. They do have penalties. And that was horrible. Gone wide and gained six tenths. Okay, that's a good sign. Come on. We might be able to catch them. Maybe. Come on. We can dream chat. That's a second out. Guys that just boxed behind us, I think Bubbly and others, they should be quicker. But as long as we don't fight and we keep that to the end, we can close it on the drivers in front because there's quite a few of them. I believe. Capcom Jack looks like he's had a moment of some sort. Struggling on the exit there, getting a lot of wheel spin. But guys, look at the tire wear now. Still a gap between front and uh, rears, but it's way less than it was. That shows you that tires are going to be much easier to drive with on that initial stint. They were brutal on that first set of inters. Absolutely brutal. Wide. Warning. One more and we get a penalty. Are you an Aston Martin Esports? Yes, I'm an ambassador for the team. I'm a driver and I'm, a, I'm an ambassador for the team. So you'll see me. Hopefully you'll see me there next week, actually. I want to I wanna head over to the facility and do a stream from there again with you guys. So hopefully that'll be next, uh, next, the next Friday. I'll let you guys know once, once that's confirmed, but... I think we were we were talking about next Friday. Uh, gap to Hydro is the same. Actually, I'm thinking. Oh, guys, yeah, I reckon. I'm calling it. I think Hydro and the guys in the top three, they went slicks. 
stayed on slicks the whole time and then they boxed into us. And if they did, that's why they're so far ahead. They're a whole pit stop ahead. Oh, God, small lockup. That was scary. Put some nice uh, wear on the fronts then. Honestly, when you get wheel spin or lockups on the inters, it's insane how much they wear. And we're not going to get P5 though, chat. We've used up all the safety cars. Quite random with the uh, with how the rain's fallen. Everyone was gambling on the strategy. Looks like we've gambled incorrectly. I feel like the pace is still pretty decent. Come on, got to keep it up. 10.2 seconds, we are closing quickly. Big lock up. Big lock up and still gains, come on. 20% now. Nine point eight. Keep watching those gaps. You never know. Especially if they get track limits. Yellow flag. Yellow flag somewhere. Is that ahead? Oh, don't give me. Oh. Okay, clear. I went really wide there the last time. I didn't. I wasn't expecting a warning, but I thought that was okay. Now that is number two. Now we definitely can't get another one. Oh, that was close. Very close. I that we didn't gain much sector three then, that was pretty poor. Come on. Last couple of laps have been really good. I think this is the third time we've lapped our teammate. What's going on here? <laughs> Bite the intake back. This is coming from an Aussie, by the way. Bro literally wrestles with snakes. I've seen, I've literally, Ben's shown me a video before of him literally boxing with a kangaroo and knocking one out. You don't mess with Ben. The RSPCA will also be in touch. Uh, we are catching a lot. It might be close, guys. If he gets an eight second, we're cooking. Oh, uh, three seconds, sorry. Okay, keep an eye on that gap ahead, please. Eight point zero seconds. Come on, we've extended the gap on the car behind. Pace is good. Seven point four. Feels smooth. Final lap of the race. We need two and a half seconds. You never know. Perfect lap, guys. And who knows? We picked the perfect time to box, by the way, because look, the tires are just hitting the cliff. We boxed at the perfect time. Seven point one. Oh, come on. Very late on the brakes. Oh my god, look at the Delta. Bro, it's, oh, he got an eight seconds! <laughs> yes! He actually hit chat limits under pressure. Look how close it is as well. We really gained that much time. We closed over 10 seconds in the space of like eight laps, seven laps or something. Maybe not even that. But we are going to finish the race in P5. I mean, all good things considered, it's not that bad. Considering we messed the strat. Oh, hang on. He's, oh, he's got 18 seconds. Brilliant. Nitro doing donuts for the fans. You'd love to see it. We're finishing P4 in the end. I'm guessing the guys that won the race will finish top three. Yeah, look at that, guys. That was the play. Jeno went big brain. The guys that did not box. Chat, when, when you said box, when we boxed, right, it's, it's we, all right? It's all of our fault. All right, I'm roping you guys in with it. Uh, when we boxed, was not good. All right, we ended up doing one more pit stop than these guys in front. Yes, our inters were, were much better at the end, which is why we were reeling them in. Um, but yeah, geez. 
We definitely did not nail that strat. We were mediums, inters, inters. And then look at that. Geno, Hydro, Gukka on the podium. All of them just went slicks right to the inters point. Geno paid by Gukka. I did box. Wait. Wait, Geno, did you box when we all did? Surely not. Surely you didn't have like 60% inters at the end. That's insane pace if you did. Oh, wow. Fair play. 67. Wow. So you've learned to Alex it. Don't read chat. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, ben, by the way, mate, is this a bad time to say that I still have not done a single uh, race run yet in an LMP2 at Sebring? I've got no experience of different traffic, different classes of traffic in a race. I might need to do some runs after this stream. We've got time for uh, two more, by the way, chat. I don't even own the LMP2. Wait, no, there's no way. There's no way. You're like an iRacing veteran. What do you mean? That is, that's hard cap. I've driven Sebring in a way. Yeah, me, me, Tom and Razen did do some wet driving the other day in like a random session, but it just turned into us three just crashing each other out. <laughs> it, was, it was so much fun. I was just running Tom off the track and then we were locking up and spinning and whatever. But I guess like, I'm somewhat familiar with how to drive it. It's so fun in the wet and eye racing. It's so fun. Because, guys, if you haven't driven it, I'm, I'm, a, I'm aware that a lot of you guys watching right now won't have driven, um, number one, eye racing, but number two, in the wet following the new recent update. It's so realistic. It's so good. You're basically, like going into, like, let's say like a, let's, let's, go, let's go extreme. If you're going into like a low speed hairpin at maximum speed, you have to almost take the inside line, the opposite of the apex, basically. It's almost like if you imagine the apex going wide, um, cutting into the corner and then exiting wide, it's almost like you're doing the opposite in the wet where you go narrow, wide into the corner and then almost like wide on the exit. Like it's... It's kind of hard to explain, but you're like avoiding the standing water firstly. But to be fast in the wet, you just have to take different lines and find different grip. It's, it's awesome. And because you feel so much for the, for, through the force feedback, you actually can feel the grip as well. That's the awesome thing. Um, right. Uh, yeah, let me... Uh, all right, hang on. I'll, I'll unban you. Two seconds. Uh, where are you? Go down the never-ending list. It's gotta be one of the recent ones. Oh, no? I get past you. Right, I'm either blind or you're not there. One last look. Very good, you're not even there. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh! Important currency to continue your F1 world road to glory. Use these to craft new parts. Yes, please. Chat, no more community event. We are doing F1 World Tech. Get me in to improve my tech level. He was there? Oh, okay, I'm blind. I, I did say, chat. Clearly, I'm blind. I'm looking for Bigfoot, right? All right, no, you're capping. What's, what's his name? What's his name? Look at the right name. What's the name? What is it? <laughs> Stop. Right, what, what am I looking for? What is this? Near the bottom, okay. Near the bottom. It's Bigfoot, okay. <laughs> How many up then, chat? How many up? <laughs> the name with the red background. Oh, okay. The name with the red background. Alfie. There we go. Found him. <laughs> Wait, console boys. Wait, is that your name? Right. Screw you guys. Right, track vote's going up. Vote for the next track. 
I'm not, I'm not. Wait, OB gate. Amazing. So you guys are yelling at me. Bro literally said his name was Bigfoot. I was looking for Bigfoot. Because he said his name was Bigfoot. What do you mean? Right, so it's OB Gamer. Right, okay, brilliant. There he is then. That one. Yeah, OB Gamer. He literally said it was Bigfoot, so all I was looking for was Bigfoot. It was, it was not on there. Wait, why? Oh, brilliant. That's his gamer tag, not his EA. Right. Fantastic. In my defense, he literally said Bigfoot. So I was looking at that on the list. Who uses the right? <laughs> right. Guys, what track? <laughs> I was like, I was like doing a triple check. Like there's, 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 there's no Bigfoot. <laughs> No, I'm not having that. He, bro, he said his EA name was Bigfoot, so I was looking on the left at the EA names only. All right, leave me alone. That's on. That's that's on my guy for for not telling me the name, the other names to look at. Never send GB to look for Bigfoot. Yeah, Bigfoot is real. Apparently, we just found him. Uh, Silverstone, Silverstone, Monza, Corp. Another one. What are we saying? Hey, YouTube. What are we saying? Give me a track. Astro, by the way, thanks for the follow. F1 Vibes. Uh, Sakaba? I definitely butchered that name, but thank you for the uh, follows, guys. Welcome in. <laughs> Who do we think will take pole today? Um, I'm not going to say. I'm not going to I'm not going to say any spoilers. But their first name rhymes with facts. That's that's what I'm going to go with. So I know it's a, I know it's a real long shot. But I mean, you guys are saying the Claire looks looks quick. Actually, I'd like to see a Ferrari on pole. Problem is, we all know who's going to cook in the race. Bahrain. Okay, cool. Thanks, George. Bahrain, it is, mate. Right, guys, pole is up. Press one in chat for Monza. Two for Silverstone. Three for Bahrain. One, two, or three for the track of your choice. George, I know you want a Bahrain, so I'm going to press three for you already, mate, in Twitch chat. And that is your vote on the board. Um. Fernando Alonso? I don't know, Ali, mate. I don't know, dudes. I'd, I'd love an Alonso pole, but I'm, I'm... Yeah. I think I need more copium for that. You mean Lewis Hamilton? Apparently, Hamilton's car is muddied. That's what I saw on Twitter earlier. I told you guys earlier, I've not... Um, I've not watched a single session so far just because of the time zone... Uh, difference. I've not been able to catch it when it's live. I think it's quite late UK time. Um, I just haven't been available when it's been on. So I don't really know who's quick. You guys were saying earlier that Ferrari looked really good. So I'd love it if they did well. If, if uh, well, I'd rather Aston, but if, if Ferrari are cooking, I want to see someone take the fight to Red Bull. But um, whatever qualifying is, Red Bull will be rapid in the race. Someone in chat was saying earlier that um, Red Bull are fourth fastest for race pace, according to practice. So if that's the case, I will eat my wheel on Monday in front of you guys with tomato ketchup with some Tommy K. I will eat my wheel in front of you guys if Red Bull are fourth fastest. If Max is fighting for like P6 in the race, then yeah, I will eat my wheel. How sick would that be though? I, I'd absolutely love it if it was like, I don't know, Leclerc... Leclerc and Alonso fighting for the win. <laughs> Let me dream. That would be sick. Max get a 360 and win again. Yeah, there's more chance of that happening. Exactly. All right, guys, one final call on the poll. Not many of you voted, guys. Press one, two, or three for the track of your choice. And um, we do have time for... Mm, we might be cutting it fine. I don't know. We might be able to do another one after this. Um, but this could be the last one. So vote wisely. One for... Uh, one for Monza, two for Silverstone, three for Bahrain. I'm actually going to run and box the wets, guys, because I've necked my energy drink. Um, and it's gone right through me. So as soon as I'm back, I'm ending the poll. So vote, and then we'll decide it. Okay, that's the next 25% race. The lobby's open, by the way. I know we're full at the moment, but if you do want to grab a seat and you see one free, it's yours. Um, we will be doing Australia 
later on we'll be doing Australia in about an hour's time short qualifying plus a 50% race if you want to enter that guys I think a mod has removed the pin message or Nitro put it on a timer um, but there is if you go over to the discord and go to the sign up channel you can get your name on the list 133 is in Bahrain let's go Scott cooking cooking mate are you, are you, well, I'll ask you when I'm back, but I want to know whether you're manual gears or not. You got, got, got to start learning the manual gears, dude. I believe in you. Oh, man. All right, two seconds, chat. Two seconds. One, two, or three. Follow your track. Oh man, right. Why well, don't start? Because not here. Right. What's one? What is one? Silverstone! Alright, GG's, GG's. Silverstone it is. Silverstone for potentially the last race. We'll see where we're at at the end of this. Let's see. Yeah, Ben, I'm gonna do some uh I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna join the VC after the stream and, and probably do some iRace running, I'm not sure. Cause we spent most of today getting the house sorted, so I might need to do a few more bits, but I look forward to it. Mate, I, I told my chat earlier, Ben, if you're still there, that uh that I'm gonna have to give you and Alex a a tutorial on how to get in and out of the rig without breaking the green screen. <laughs> Sergio, thanks for the follow as well, mate. Welcome in. Guys, this is 25% uh, Silverstone. Again, this is uh, an open lobby with you guys. Anyone and everyone, welcome to join. I believe we've got a few uh, new faces in the lobby as well. So just a heads up for you uh, OGs in the lobby. You guys from chat, make sure you uh, you drive carefully because there's going to be some moves. Bigfoot is back from his ban. Let's hope we don't get a big send. When you guys start to wear exclamation mark stint. So, um, I don't know if this is actually the final confirmed stint. I was trying to ask Razan earlier. I might have missed his comment. Uh, are these boys available in the VC? Yeah, it's in a private chat though. I'm not going to join them just in case. Just in case. We have a, we have a gentleman's agreement chat that we, uh, that if we're live, we generally don't join the, the private VCs. <clears throat> if I won, I would donate 50 subs. Yeah, guys, I don't know when I'm driving tomorrow. It, we, you should see me live at about 4 o'clock GMT. So think of when, when I'm normally live for Grade Series, minus two hours. That's when I should be live tomorrow. We're, we're going go-karting, so providing everything works fine and we're... We're back in time, whatever. Should be live at around four o'clock ish to start our stint. Um don't know who will be driving first, we'll have to figure it out, but maybe I'll do the early stint and then pass it over to uh, to Alex or Ben. If GB wins the next Create Series race, I'll donate sixty eight subs. Does is that the next one for Creator Series or my next race? Because I'm missing race week one, Rob. So let's make it fair. <laughs> 
Yeah, exactly anti grab. That's what I'm thinking. Bro, new. Oh, please let me do my setup. I'm mashing the button, chat. I'm mashing the button, chat. Please. I just want to pick my setup, chat. Please. I've got 10 seconds or I've got to restart the lobby. Please let me select my... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah, that's the one, Nick. Yeah, guys, I'm not panicking. Stop panicking. Never in doubt. Oh, someone's definitely going to hit me here. 100%. Oh, I was wrong. Let's go. I don't know why I keep starting so high up. Maybe it's not on random. There's a lot of... <laughs> Brilliant. I'm like Moses right now. Why? Because I saw you. Oh my god, that was close. <laughs> that has to be a safety guy. Come on, let's burn, let's burn, let's burn, burn, burn. Maybe not. Oh, I lost the rear then. Jesus. Okay, we're okay. Up to P9 already. Oh, Ferrari, not there. It's actually Nitro that spun me. Oh, down to P18. Just like that. P19. You know the rule, chat? Whatever happens, GB has to come out worse. It's a VSC. Is it going to be a full safety car, though? It's a DNF car. Okay, caution, caution. Virtual safety car is out. Reduce speed and maintain a positive delta on your dash. Yes. Okay, you've got a full course caution. The safety car is out. That was good because my brakes stopped working. Penalties ahead as well. Bad Nitro, yeah, exactly. That was one of those unfortunate ones where, like, there was space, but it's just, uh, I think it was his rear wheel with my front right. Oh, sorry, front left. Yeah, it was a decent start. I was just trying to stay alive. Of course. Wait, rain? Wait. Why do they just take so long? Am I tripping? Why are they... Did I, I didn't have a penalty or, or a damaged wing. Why were my pit crew just like, nah? Why is it raining? What? Is it actually? I can't see it. Oh my god, it is! What is going on? Weather report. Oh my god! 20 minutes of rain! Surely it's Inters. Surely. Surely it's Inters. No, it has to be Inters, chat. It has to be. We're going Inters. We're going Inters. This is going to be another wet race. Wow. Another wet race. Weather report. Light rain will stay with us for at least 20 minutes, maybe more. Light rain is here to stay. Dry has definitely seemed like the fastest tire at the moment. Okay, have we pulled off? The best bluff you have ever seen. Come on. I hope I've called this right. I think it's going to stay light for the whole duration. It's going to be a slidey but dry race. That's my prediction. P5. We have just gained an absolute mountain of positions. But is it going to be a good call or not? What would you guys... Guys, would you stay out here or would you box for Inters? I'm, I'm seeing all the, all the sweats behind on Inters. I know it's slicks right now. 
But what do we think? The rain is going to be here for 20 minutes. I will just do what Jeno does. Where is Jeno? Let me guess. He's ahead. Jeno boxed. Oh, this is going to be spicy, man. Wait, is uh, You need the proper telemetry. Oh, yeah. I do need to cheat. You're right. I need to be able to cheat and see the... The actual weather. I, I hate it so much. I really... I wish... I wish I could disable that telemetry feature. Because... I feel like it's such a ridiculous advantage in, like, creator series. Like, I, I really... It, it bugs me. The only reason I want the telemetry is because some others use it. That's the only reason. Why you put the pit lane thing on? I have five second penalty. Stop speeding into the pits, then. It's on so that you break at the normal time and enter it properly. <laughs> Because people just drive full speed and abuse it otherwise. And then guys like me with no assist and then get absolutely screwed over because uh, we have to do it normally. I think I think pretty much everyone in the lobby is running uh, no pit assist anyway. Oh boy, this is going to be very interesting indeed. Very, very interesting. Is it going to get wet enough for Inter chat? At the moment, it hasn't. At the moment, it's a good call, but we don't know. If this if this race continues and it does go Inters, we're in trouble. We are in trouble. We may have just bluffed the entire lobby here. This could be the greatest call you've ever seen. Come on. Oh, <laughs> okay. On a pit entry. Tires are very warm, lovely stuff. Are we are we going? Are we going? What's bro? What's bro? Oh zero. Okay, clear. Zero just didn't get going. It's a little bit slidey. Gotta be careful. The grip is obviously not the same. Hello! Bit of contact there as the Mercedes veered left. Okay, so Going to it all the way. Oh, he's backing off. Nice. Try and get onto P1 if we can. Jack is flying though on those soft tyres. So far, so good. Come on. Oh, it's still flat through through cops, guys. Oh my word. Nice Magus and Beckett. We took two tenths out of Jack there. More than that. Just good pace. Am I fast on the straights? Oh, that's a poor exit. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by point zero seconds. Lovely stuff, guys. Oh, our pace is great. Let's go. Seven tenths up. Track is getting wetter. Oh boy, guys, this is the longest, longest uh, pit lane on the calendar. If it does go into us, Jenna might be cooking. Why did I break? That was uh, interesting. Wait, is it DRS this lap or not? You might be next lap. Yeah, next lap. Can we get through now though? I think he's burning. Keep it clean on the warnings. Yikes! Didn't think I broke that late. Apparently I did.
Oh, that was close. Can see me rotating, playing with the diff quite a lot throughout this lap. Those high speed corners, I really do try and get around to 50 diff as much as I can, try and get that extra uh, rotation. Back to 55 for the traction. Okay. Sending it. Looks like we've got a good fight here. I need to fight it hard. Keep doing our thing. Nine seconds to Jeno on those inters. It's a great line. Right, it's time to stretch our legs. idea for this high speed corner but quite tricky on the exit the uphill camber yeah I don't think I did break too late last time yeah look how much time I've gained through there in like three tenths that's why I hit him he's using battery down here though he's trying to stay with us We're on the better tyre as well. Has to be said. DRS is so powerful at Silverstone though, guys. It's so powerful. Oh, he's going to go for the move again. Oh wait, is it actually? I think the grip is getting less, guys. Weather report. So this rain could be with us for a while. Light rain conditions for the foreseeable future. Okay, dry seem like the best tire for now. All over the place then. He was. We do have to be a little bit careful because all this fighting could cost us if we do need to box because Jenna would have a massive gap and that's a warning we do need to be careful if Jack keeps sending it it's gonna, it might hurt both of us it just depends on whether we need to box or not if we don't, if it is dry until the end and we've called this perfectly then then it's fine, it's fair game we can scrap away because at the moment there's no one else that can uh, get close I think that was our first warning by the way guys Jenner lost four seconds. Not in the last lap, did he? Oh, wait, what happened to Jack? Did Jack just spin? I didn't even see that. Box softs? Nah. At this point, we just stay out. We don't box, surely. I mean, we can box, but... Have you boxed already? Yeah, yeah, we boxed, we boxed. Like in the, I'm liking the name change, by the way. Seb, it's gonna, it's, it's gonna take some getting used to. I'm pretty sure when I when I met you in uh, in Sweden, mate. Oh, sorry, the Maldives. I even called you Badger. It's gonna take some getting used to. Yeah, I like the name change, dude. Ferrari cold. It's full wet conditions. I think we've called this to perfection. I think this is an Aston Strat. But if you guys have watched Creator Series before, you know that anything could happen. We could get struck by lightning and not win this race. You never know. Oh, there's still grip to go flat through here through turn one. Oh, we made such a good call, man. That was such a good bluff, chat. <laughs> Unreal. We have bluffed the entire grid, almost. Yeah, because I wasn't sure whether Jack boxed or not, given he was on those softs. 
Should have really got fastest lap, by the way, but I think it was when we had contact with Jack into Vale. I was like six or seven tenths up, and then we lost it all there. That through here? Oh, a little lift that was. Probably is flat, though. Maggots and Beckett's is just glorious. My favorite corner sequence of any track. So, so glorious when you hook it up. Which I didn't quite do there, but if you can try and open it up as much as possible. It's all about the entry. Oh, okay. <laughs> Not all about that entry. And that is definitely what she said. All right, pace is strong. We're on the right tyre as well. I don't think this could have gone any better, to be honest, guys. We've basically got four laps. Oh, my God, Jack didn't even box. Oh, wow. I don't think he boxed, guys. So he made the right call staying out. But we... What did we do? It was the first safety car where I boxed for mediums, didn't I? So he must have just stayed out on that safety car. So the best thing for Jack would have been to box when everyone went inters to box, but go slicks. That would have been the best. Look at the gap, guys. That is absolutely insane. Jeno's now gone to the softs. Look how far behind he is. Jeno is... What's the gap? It's like nearly a minute behind or something. That's what two pit stops do, does to you here. He'll be flying on those softs and get the fastest lap. But Jesus, shows how much we've nailed the, uh, the strat. You were 73 on the ins as well. That's another thing as well, guys, is if you get the inters call wrong. As you saw with me at Austria, you just, your tyres are shot to bits. The they just die immediately. We don't need to take any risk at this point. We can just coast it round, guys. Sunday drive mode, Max Verst This is this right here. This right here is <laughs> as our teammate stacks it in the wall. I was gonna say this is Max Verstappen mode. This is how Verstappen feels every race. Not a car in sight. And just cruising. Talking to GP about the weather. About the uh, the, the Sunday Sunday night plans. Chilling. Tires are on 31%. They're actually uh, equal on wear as well, front and rears, which is very nice. Anti-grab out of the session as well. There'll be no safety guys. We had two in this race already. The only thing that, that could come out is red flags, but it's too late now. There were two DNFs then, which maybe would have brought out the red flag, but it's lap 11. It's too late. I actually don't... Guys, does anyone know the latest you can get red flags? I'm assuming it's lap 10. No, I don't actually know. I don't think we've had a situation before where we've had a, the latest possible red flag. I'm not sure what it is. If you are tuning in, we are indeed driving on zero AI. Just, uh, just doing some practice of how to drive in wet weather on slicks. On the fourth, la fourth last lap, same as safety car VSE. Okay. Oh. I tell you what, Je I'd laugh if it was Inters at the end, just because Jello boxed. <laughs> Imagine. And to be honest, bro probably would have got a puncher anyway. Look how fast he's on those soft seed. Holy crap. Hey, what's up, Borax? Welcome in, dude. <laughs> Penultimate lap, by the way, guys. How should we how should we cross the line, guys? How should we cross the line? Do we do it in reverse? Should we back it up across the line? What are we saying? Get your get your get your ideas in chat now. You want me to reverse across the line? Yeah, Orex says yes.
the biggest like ego way to end the race. Pushing a little bit at the moment. 37% wear on both front and rears. Do a 360. Yeah, but I'll probably end up stacking it in the wall if I do that. That's from, that's what you guys want. <laughs> you want to you want to bring me back to uh, back to to the same level as everyone else in the lobby. <laughs> Somehow finish P2 while nearly a pit stop ahead. Yeah, it's not been a it's not been an eventful one in terms of racing action. We had a good scrap with jackets at one point. But I was unaware that he hadn't even boxed, otherwise I would have just been fully cruising. And it is, um... It is going to be a very dominant win. Oh, I've broken... I don't know why I broke so late there. <laughs> I'm, yeah. Um, finishing the pits. Would that actually work? No, if I go backwards in the pits, that's 100% uh, that's not working. All right then, guys. Down the hangar straight for the final time. We have absolutely aced the strategy today. So much so that we can finish in style. As we head into Vale, into the final few corners, on the corner exit. Slam it in reverse, in style. And a across the line we go in neutral. <laughs> there we go. It's a W. What a strat, guys. We absolutely bluffed the entire lobby. Everyone boxed for inses. Are we stayed out on slicks? Jeez, I think we were the only car to, to have done our pit stop and then to have got the right call there. I'm pretty sure every single driver had either stayed out on the starting tires or they'd, uh, they'd, gone, they'd gone inses. Jack takes a P2 in the end, even after boxing so late. Um... Fair play. I think it, I think VM Nola crossed the line in P2, but had a penalty. Oh, what a strat, guys. I saw you had a small heart attack when that Mercury passed. No, no, I was fine, but I accidentally, naturally, because the revs were bouncing, I, I, I upshifted. It's just, just force of habit. So I went into neutral. <laughs> oh, amazing. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, GB domination could bore fans. I agree. I agree. Guys, if we can have a creator series race like that, that'd be great. If we could just have one where everyone bottles a strat and we win by a pit stop, that'd be wonderful. <laughs> My stuff's wrong 52%. Oh, what? Before you boxed? Yeah, that's a lot. You can, the thing is, you can go so long on tyres here. Like, did you box, Jack? Was that, wait, yeah, was that your second pit stop? I know. Yeah, that was your first. Yeah, you had to box. I was going to say, even on uh, even in, on 52, mate, at that point, I, I would have gone to the end of the race because the pit, pit, uh, the pit lane is so long and you could probably drive comfortably until like 80% tyres, I would have thought here. I remember whenever we've done crate series here, I've usually run long because DRS is so powerful. Stay in the DRS train, stay out on worn tyres because of the time you're gaining from DRS. Um, and in the long run, it's the quicker strat rather than boxing for fresh tyres here. Undercut is not as... Yeah, it's not that great around Silverstone. <clears throat> Jesus, what a race. Even doing the 180 on the final corner, reversing across the line, we still finished 26.5 seconds clear of P2. That is what happens at Silverstone when you nail your strap. Uh, right, have we got time for one more? I think we do. Guys, I think we can force them one more. What are we saying? You guys want to see a different track? I reckon we can do one more. We might be starting Australia teeny tiny bit delayed, possibly. I think we do. I think, yeah, if I get a track pole up now, I reckon we can full send it. Guys, what are we saying? Fire some tracks at me for, for a pole. What are we saying? We've done Silverstone. Um, 
Silverstone Hungry, and I've already forgotten the other track. Um, fine, I'll put Spa back in. I'm, I'm putting that back in there. I'm putting Saudi back in. Brazil. Oh, we haven't done Brazil for a while. So yeah, we'll do that then. Cool. Uh, if we get more rain at Brazil as well, I think Spa or Brazil is a good chance of rain, isn't there? All right, guys. Poll is live right now. Press one in chat for Spa, two for Saudi, three for Brazil. That's going to be our final 25% race. Then we're starting Australia straight after this. One, two, or three. We did do Spain at the start, but I mean, it was only a five lapper. Morgan, by the way, thanks for the follow. Exiled Foxes as well. Appreciate it. Welcome in. Uh, appreciate the follows as well from uh, from all you legends tuning in for the first time. Um, I don't know whether we had spaces in the lobby there, but the lobby is open. I think we do have a couple new faces in, which is cool. You guys are more than welcome to grab a seat when it's free. <clears throat> Remove Hungry. We did Hungry earlier. We did 25% Hungry. We did Hungry for the first race, I think it was. Uh, but yeah, one, two, or three for the track of your choice, guys. One for Spa, two for Saudi, three for Brazil. Brazil is winning right now. If you want to change that, make sure you smash one, two, or three. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna leave this up for like five minutes. So if you wanna, if you wanna choose a track, do it now. If you're on YouTube or whatever, you wanna vote, just, just give me a number and I'll vote it for you. Type two if you think Verstappen will win this weekend. Interesting track there, Jack. Type one if you think Leclerc will win this weekend. Oh, we got a, we got a three on YouTube from Charizard. All right, I got you. I got you, Char. Bosh. There's a three. I know you can't see it, but I did press three for you. It's another vote on uh, on Brazil. George wanted number one. Too slow, mate. Too slow. Otherwise, I would have pressed it. I, I'd rather spar as well, to be honest. If I could choose any of these three, I reckon I'd probably go spa maybe maybe saudi to be honest i quite jetta jetta was uh i felt like we had good pace for there for crate series but our oh, crate series was so painful man we got rear-ended by razin and then rear-ended by b-roy no no fault on my own that race we had good pace though fast car needs to go fast car does get a lot of complaints to be fair but yeah i uh I'll make a mental note. Fast car, if you're in chat, it's not the first time. I will have to yeet if it, because, if it, um, if it keeps happening. Right, uh, let's end it. Done. It is Brazil. Bosh. Last race. Load it up. Are we going to get rain? That is the question. Come on, give us a wet race. I beg. Give us another wet race. We've so far had... Oh, yeah, we did Austria, didn't we? So we had Hungary dry. Then we had Austria, which, was, which ended in the wet. We got the strat wrong. And then we nailed the strat at Silverstone where it did rain, but it was on slicks. I wonder what this is going to be. Type 3, if you think Lando will win this weekend. <laughs> later, later is, uh, is not having it. Le, you're a, you're a McLaren fan, aren't you? I'll be amazed if Lando wins, though. Jesus. We can only hope. I'd love to see Lando win his first race. I'd love to see Fernando win his first race in God knows how long. Many a year. Um, Hamilton would be awesome to see his, his first race win since 2021. Uh, to be honest, just seeing Leclerc win a race would be cool. I know it's like not been... Actually, no, he didn't win a race last season, did he? Yeah, it's been a little bit of a while for Leclerc, but it would just, be, it would just mark a nice change to see a different team win a race. Leclerc seems to be cooking. Ah, it's practice though. Red Bull always sandbag in practice. Even if even if Verstappen's quickest, it's not by much in practice, and then the race is like a second a lap quicker. Uh, what's up, Ghosty? Welcome in, dude. I remember I remember being in uh, various Twitch chats with you there last night at the uh, DGen hours for for us. We were just in VC, just hopping into random streams. Raymond, by the way, I see you. Uh, unfortunately, I can't vote for for Brazil, but it, it's Brazil anyway, so we're cooking. All right. 25% um, Brazil. Uh, safety cars on. Red flags on. Damage is obviously on. Let's hope we can survive.
even though I'm neutral about Albon, I'd like to see him crash Logan's car. If he if he does crash Logan's car, oh boy. I, I don't even think it... I think it looks worse on Williams than it would Albon. It obviously would look bad on Albon, don't get me wrong, but I think Albon would be kind of in the mud if that happens. Oh, not again. Please, just let me pick this. Please. I've got such a love-hate relationship with this. Please. Thank you. Okay. Oh my god, it's not let me... Oh, please, just let me change my setup. Please. Hmm. Alright, I've changed my setup. Where am I starting? Oh, he's random. Cool. Right, let's drop to the back. I think we might. I think something's gonna hit us. Nice. going to be chaotic, isn't it? All right. That's not a bad exit, is it? Five positions? Oh. Oh, we just absolutely snuck past zero then. Zero. I'm not going to lie. I kind of robbed you there. Wait, I didn't even check the weather. Is it raining? Wait, set up. Screen? What am I missing? Why are you guys saying screen? Or have I just missed that? No Gloves? <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> I'm so confused. Uh, weather report. Weather report. Weather report. Weather report. Guys, it looks very grey. Was it supposed to be rain at the end of this race? It can't be, right? Because if it's already saying... Dry now. Steering wheel. I hate you guys. Especially Ben. Absolutely despise that guy. Guys, we do it. Messy, 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 messy. I got a messy, I got a messy. You've got to give that position back, mate. We're under safety car conditions and you can't overtake. Woo! Oh, they weren't even boxing. <laughs> Brilliant. I think I'm pretty sure they all stayed out. Why have they stayed out? Is that is there something I don't know? Come on. Why is this taking so long? 2.5? What's going on with Aston's pit crew today? They held me up in the other race. In uh, Austria, I think it was. Oh, no. Silverstone. It was Silverstone, wasn't it? Silverstone, they took an absolute age. They were, they were just walking around, chilling. Yeah, they do need sacking. Uh, what's up, Seth, by the way? Welcome in on YouTube. I see you there. Hope you doing well, mate. Guys, while we're in the safety car, I asked you guys this earlier, but I'm going to ask it in a different way. Right. I want to know from you guys, who is staying up to watch the Grand Prix live? Maybe in your time zone, it's not even late. But who is going to watch the Grand Prix live? Press 1. Press 2 if you're going to watch a recording. I want to know. Uh, who is just... What did those Lenovo sponsor boards do to, do to this guy? Someone someone really does not like Lenovo. What are we saying? Oh, we got a mix already. Jesus. There's ones, there's two. Seth just says me. <laughs> I'm guessing that was for the first one. Oh, yeah, you press one. Yeah. Oh, there's a, there's a, there's a big mix. It's going to be 4 a.m. start. Yeah, it's, uh, same go, same. So I was talking to Ben about this, actually, because we're not sure whether we... Um, Bigfoot, please don't take out the boards. We, we, yeah, we weren't sure whether we were going to stay up and watch the race or not, but I think it's probably going to be a recording. I don't know. We'll see. If the night flies by, who knows? If we do, if we do stay up and watch the Grand Prix, though, Ben, if you're still there, mate, it's. Um, I think we're going to spend most of our Sunday sleeping. Six AM here after a birthday party. I don't even go to bed. Jesus. 
I feel like I'm missing what's going on around me. I can't lie. Oh, wait. Did everyone not box because of the extra lap? Oh, yeah. So I actually put more wear on, on my tyres. Only 1%, but maybe that wasn't a good play. We are P13. Interesting. Okay. Remember last year's recording and it was like three hours. Big up the McLarens in it, says Welsh. Welcome in, dude. Midnight for you, Seth. Oh, that's all right. Jesus Christ. What is going on in front? Alex Albon got given the sergeant's car because it's his birthday today. Safety car in. I wonder how many drivers have stayed out. There's got to be a fair few that haven't boxed. Oh, fast cars involved in something. What's, what's fast car doing then? Do you need to kick in? Shouldn't really use use any battery there. Fast car is all over the place though. Look at him. Okay, clear. okay, yeah, he needs to go. He needs to go. He is not. A, he is. He is quite literally the opposite of a fast car. I'm P7, chat. What is that restart? Bigfoot lost it. Uh, we got to get past fast car, which clearly is going to be an issue, and we got to do it in the. Tight and wind a bit as well. Fantastic. Oh, God. Okay, he's let me through. Oh, Jesus. If Fast Car has signed up for the community event, though, it, it will be a GG, I'm afraid. After seeing that turn one move. Oh my god. It's hard not to hit people at the moment. They're going so slow. And just like that, Jello's all over the back of us and Jello's already through. VSC only. VSC only. Cool. We survived from the drivers behind. Let's try and recover this battery. It was fast car? Okay, yeah, cool. Yeah, fair enough. I'm not going to even respond to that one. <laughs> Seth says, I can't believe I'm staying up to hear the Dutch anthem. I want to hear the Dutch anthem. It's been a while. It's been too long. Two weeks is too long. Uh, Jenno? The track is clear, green flag. Oh, I'm scared! Oh god, that's why I'm scared. DRS has been enabled. DRS Good. Burning everything. On the outside, lovely stuff. Here we go. I would have P3 then to tap the guys ahead. Put Jenna on the back of us. Uh, that's an AI by the looks of it. So it is only one. Good job. Nice overtake. Oh, bro, that felt really early. Okay, well, that's an amazing move, clearly. Sorry, Ahmed. Again, I swear that wasn't too early into there, but... 
Oh, too late on the brakes, I mean. Don't want to yield yet. Don't want to yield yet. Gonna have to. He's not using. Oh my god. It's forcing me to use as well. It's not good. Maybe I didn't need to. That was a bit of a squeeze for me there. Not intentional. But it's just side by side all the way with Nitro. Jesus! Oh, he's gone for a drift. I'm more than happy to stay behind at the end of this. Is he using battery? That's the question. No, he's not. So we've got a bit of a DRS train here. There's four cars in the fight. It's Hydro, myself, Nitro, and Geno. Well, that's not good. Ugh. Side by side for the back. Oh, he might, be, he might get me here. I'm not sure. No, he won't. Surely not. That was a move on the inside. Was that Night Show that sent it? What a move. We're pulling away from the rest of the pack. P4 is some distance clear from fifth already. Okay, there's been an incident on track resulting in loose debris. Fortunately, the marshals that was too late. To Hey guys, how are we doing smiles? Are we ready for Australia, mate? Hey, legend, sir. Thank you so much for the two-month, dude. Appreciate that. Thank you for the two-month prime. I'm ready for Australia. Uh, I don't, I'm not going to watch it live, though. So, not sure if that counts. I'm right, losing two positions here. And I had a big moment there. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, there's a little small bit of contact there. Apologies, Nitro. That was the slightest tiny bit of contact, but it was enough to unsettle the rear then into turn four. I did leave space. It just... Such a tiny amount of contact there. If, they, if that happens in any either way, if it's wheel side to side or even a bit of like front wing, that's absolutely fine. But just managed to unsettle the car. Give him a little switch on the apex. We don't really want to be leading into here because it just means we're going to get swallowed up on the straight. But here we are. We will lose two positions again. And in the meantime, look at that gap to P5. Uh, I'm not sure if this setup is an SRC setup, actually. Some of mine are, and some of mine are not. It's a bit of a rubbish answer, but I don't know. I think it's not. I, and, and I will say, um, I changed the wings myself. Oh, Nitro on the cutback. No way. Go on, go for it. Go for it. What a battle this is. This is great fighting. Oh, no, she's gone very deep for a little drift. His tyres will not be enjoying that. Which one of them is going to be without DRS? That's the question. Hydro's well in this as well. Come on. I know it's not a good idea to keep chipping away at that battery, but trust me, I know how quick these boys are. More important than we get track position. I think I've got better straight line speed than both of them, potentially. 
I hope. Oh, I had to break a lot there. Probably a bit too much. Back into P1, though. This is going to be a four-way fight for the win at this rate. And we're all on the same tyre. They've got one lap fresher tyres, but it's a lap of safety cars. So we're pretty much all the same. Our teammate is not going to give us a lucky DRS. Looks like that's an AI car. Oh, that's not a good exit. It's lost a chunk of time there. We will be third. In the straight. DRS just worth so much down the back straight. Hey, what's up, TK? Welcome in. Oh, this is such a good scrap. Little bit of contact there. Not a good time for us to lose out. Yeah, we got better straight line speed, Jesus. So the corners is where we're worried. Oh, that's a warning. Cannot let them get away. That's the most important thing. Oh, that's poor. A few mistakes creeping in. A few mistakes creeping in. Oh, no. Not like this, chat. Not like this. Oh, no. How, how have we just lost it? Oh, no. This is bad. This is bad. I don't care about finishing fourth. I'm going to dump everything. Legend, Nitro. Absolute legend. Green flag. Oh, I love it. We're screwed on battery, but I don't care. I just want to be here, chat. These boys are rapid in front and they're faster through the corners. Have to stay close. Just focusing. Oh, that's... Warning number two, that's very sloppy. I don't know why I'm struggling so much now. The tyres hit some sort of cliff. Oh, they have. They're on 25, that's why. I haven't adapted well to the to the cliff. Bro, just they're so much quicker through the corners. Holy crap. Yeah, literally, tyres tires are now all over 25, so... I've got no battery, and we're struggling. Especially if I keep DRS swapping like that. Oh, this could be the lap we lose it. This could be the lap we lose it. I can't do anything now. I've tried everything, chat. I don't care about podium or finishing P4. I want to try and get the win, but... You know, I could have just held onto my battery and fought Hydro, but... That's not the way to do it. Yeah, we'd need them to fight. But they'll be so much faster through the corners. And if I run wide one more time, we are definitely finishing P4. Okay, that's us with five laps of fuel remaining. Five laps of fuel left. Wide. Don't tell me he's got DRS. Oh my god. Oh, that was so close. Surely he didn't get DRS, surely not. No, he didn't. Oh, oh they're swapping though. They're swapping DRS, which is not good. That's not good, chat. We're in trouble. Slow. 
Yeah, yeah, they, 100% they're conserving, yeah. I know that, but I can't stay with them. Because uh, I'm too slow for the corners. Straight line speed is great, but... Yeah, they're gone now. I might get DRS and back markers. One of them is not an AI. Oh my god. Oh my god, we literally got saved. For now. Oh my god, what is that? What wings is the Alpine running? Look at that straight line speed! <laughs> Bro's pulled nearly a second. What have I just seen? Ah, oh, they're gone, chat. They're gone. With only three laps to go. Ah. Oh. Okay, so the gap to the car ahead, 1.5 seconds. That Alpine's going to be so slow for the corner, surely. Unless they're on fresh tyres, actually. Maybe they are. Because our tyres will be not very happy at this stage. Oh, he's on softs. Probably is on fresh tyres, but definitely going through the corners. It's actually not been a bad lap. Only four tenths off the PB. Again, we get DRS. Is Hyjo going to move? Is he going to jump through now? He's obviously conserving. He's obviously waiting. Okay, Checo is out. Hyjo will not no for go for the move yet. DRS again. That's lovely. One of the Mercedes. Oh, wait. Mercedes is off? No, that's not Nitro. Not sure in general we're gone. And now Hydro stays behind. This is a fight for the podium with a McLaren. It's not where we wanted to be, but we've got no choice. There we are. Not going to be back-to-back -back race wins. Alpine looking slow through these corners now. But uh, as long as he's ahead, he's helping us massively. Ties are on 40. Oh, Alpine, what are you doing? Very good. There goes Hydra then. So on to the final lap. We'll be P4. Oh, he... Didn't open his DRS for a second. Okay, mate. Final lap. Keep your concentration and let's bring it home. Now Hydra's going to get DRS. Oh dear. Straight line speed is way better than IJ. He's running way more downforce. No question that I've struggled through the corners in this one. Oh, that's bad braking. Hydro should be quicker through the corners. I think he's got this chat. Let's see. It's a good exit. Now we dump everything. How have we got enough? If he starts flashing now, we do. Oh my God, we might get him. This is going to be close. Come on. Yes! Come on! We got it by 55 thousands! I was so over the match. He was better. Jesus! Come on! We get a podium anyway. We get a podium anyway. Nitro and Jenna were too quick. I tried my best to hang on to them. Oh, Jesus. Well, at least we, at least we hold on to that. <laughs> Hydra was P3. Wait, what do you mean? Hydra was P3. What did I say? Whatever it was, we finished P3, chat. We get a drag race to the line. 
At least we didn't finish P4. But I wanted to be in that fight with Nitro and Jedi. I tried my best to keep it with them uh, with them for the corners. I was obviously running quite low wings that race. I did take the normal setup and just drop the wings. So maybe that was a bit of a bit of a mistake. <clears throat> right. Uh, King, thank you for the follow and critics as well. Appreciate it. Matt, thank you for the raid, by the way. Appreciate it, dude. I hope you had a good stream. Um, is that M Mateo? Sorry. That's Mateo. Yeah. Sorry. My small writing on my activity feed. Um, good timing, by the way, guys, because we are now going to do our Australian Grand Prix community event. It is going to be a 50% race, short qualifying, and I'm going to call the grid any second now. I'm going to load it up on Discord and I'll be... Yeah, we'll, we'll back at the lobby and get that set straight up. Um, we've had some really good races tonight. Had some really good races. I've enjoyed the enjoyed the community races tonight. It's been good. <clears throat> Send us your BBM pin. I got you. I do like a bit of Blackberry Messenger. I I used to. That's the yeah. That's when you know you're. Uh, that's when you know you're slightly older. I used to used to be all over that. Because that was like free messaging back in the day, wasn't it? It was like text messages back then were like 10 pence or something per text. BBM was just free. The good old days. <clears throat> yeah, thank you, Mateo. I appreciate it, mate. Appreciate the uh, the rate. Uh, once again, welcome in, everyone. Welcome in if you're tuning in. Uh, it's good to be live with you guys because it's, like I said, it's I said to you guys before, I think uh, I think it's been a while since I've actually had a proper session with you guys. We, we missed last week, I think. I'm pretty sure we missed last week. Um, so yeah, so it's good to uh, good to be here. Um, we've got Sebring tomorrow. If you're new in chat, um, I'm going to be doing, if you do exclamation mark stints, we're going to be doing a 12-hour endurance race at Sebring. Um, ben Daly, Alex Gillen are going to be around my house. Um, we're going to be doing an hour each across a three-hour stint in the rig. So that is probably going to be chaotic if you want to see that. We should be live from my side around about 4 o'clock p.m. tomorrow. Um, hopefully a little bit earlier, but we are doing go-karting beforehand. So if we're running slightly late or whatever, times are slightly off, you know why. Um, but exclamation mark stint will give you uh, the full detail. Uh, right, let's get this set up. With who you're doing it, there you go. Um, got all the names in there. It's... Uh, it's all, um, everyone from Crate Series? Yeah, every, everyone is from Crate Series. Everyone bar Yorick in there is a full-time driver. Razin, I don't know. Look, the schedule may slightly change in terms of like the, like who's doing what stints. That was the original provisional one that we put in the private chat. Um, but those are definitely the drivers racing, unless anyone has to pull out last minute. I know Fabio's working, uh, so he, he wouldn't do the early ones. Hayden, I'm pretty sure, is starting. Tom wanted to do the one after, and then that leads into me, Alex, and Ben, hopefully. Hopefully, we have a car, guys, because I'm bigging this up. But at the end of the day, if Hayden bins it in the wet, I'm pretty sure Hayden's stint is going to be in the wet. So if you want to see qualifying and then Hayden start, make sure you uh, make sure you go check out Hayden Gullis as well. I don't know whether he'll be live streaming on Twitch or YouTube. He, he definitely does both, so go and check out Hayden. Um, but he will be kicking things off for us. Uh, everyone should be live. So again, expect Tom to be live for his stint um, shortly after Hayden. I don't know whether Tom will like spectate Hayden on his stream. I'm assuming he'll only do his his stint live. But again, make sure you check out the guys for um, for their sides too. Uh, let's let's load this up and let's start calling some names. Lit assassin in the wall. <laughs> oh, please no, please please no, Hayden. Come on, I, I believe in Hayden. Ex teammate, bathtub buddy. If you know, you know. We like Hayden. We want we want Hayden the cook. What track are we doing again? <laughs> Australia. Definitely went the wrong way for that. How many laps is it? Twenty nine laps. Short qualifying and dynamic weather. I'm guessing we have no threat of uh, rain for this weekend's race, but hopefully we get some rain in this one. We'll see. Sometimes in the game it does give you rain in Australia, so. What filters? It's uh, Discord signups only. Um, there was a message pinned earlier, but it's gone. I don't know what happened. Uh, it was there very briefly. But anyway, we. Um, I'll go and find the uh, the 
sign ups. So apologies. Normally there is a message pinned helping you guys sign up for it, but it's always Discord sign ups. We've been doing this concept for we're literally like the first one to start this, like two and a half, nearly pushing three years ago. Um, in fact, oh yeah, chat, it's nearly my three year anniversary in like, I think it's around 10th of 11th of April is when I started. Officially, it was earlier, but in terms of like properly creating content on the F1 scene, you know, actually getting into it properly was, was around mid April in 2021. Maybe we should do, uh, do a big stream for that or something. I don't know. Anyway, right, guys, if you hear your name, please feel free to join. So if, guys, anyone on the wait list and on the first 19, um, please get the filters ready. So put long race, short quality, and European uh, servers. And then obviously look for GB68 as soon as I pop up. I'm going to have the lobby invite only now. I'm going to open it very briefly, and I'm going to close it again so that we don't get any more random from the menu joining. Um, so you've got to be quick. Okay, so... Uh, Nick, Checo, Carpic, Smith, Jeno, Emre, Nola, uh, Lee, Ellis, Jashan, Innocence, Nitro, Sert Dogan, Leita, ICU, Berkey, Kilza, Timo, and Not Paul. If you guys heard your names, please feel free to join right about now. Oh, message is pinned. Legend. Wait, did I miss that? Oh, no, no, no. You just pinned it. Nice. No, actually, you just... <laughs> you pinned Shan's... <laughs> nice. You pinned the wrong... Definitely pinned the wrong one there. All right. Um, perfect. We've got 12 in. Like I said, you've got to be quick. Lobby's already in, but only. Who hasn't got a seat whose name I called out? Who's, who's tr tr still trying to get a seat? Just give me a me. Because um, start looking at the wait list. Axe is waiting in the, in the wings as well. Well done, Nitro. Wait, Nitro, are you actually not in? What are you doing? Oh, you trying to pin... Yeah, you're trying to pin messages. No worries. <laughs> it's for a good cause, mate. It's all good. We're starting roundabout on time as well. Okay, uh, Checo, Jimski, Jack. Yeah, I'm, tr I'm trusting you guys. Jack, you definitely signed up. I can't see you on the sign up, so am I just missing your name? Checo, you're literally in the lobby, you absolute. Ugh, why? Uh, okay, I'm going to call the names one more time. And I'm going to go from the waitlist. Nick, Checo, Carpic, Smith, Jeno, Emre, Nola, Lee, Ellis, Jashan, Innocence, Nitro, Sert Dogan, Leita, ICU, Berkey, Kilza, Timo, Not Paul. Lobby is open in three, two, one. Anyone that's not in will then start calling from the waitlist. So those of you guys signed up, um, get ready on the waitlist because I'll start going through it. Emre's me. That's call zero. Join then, quick. Join, 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 join. Lobby's open, guys. I was open for a long time. Oh, yeah, you're in. Yeah, my bad. You're, you're so high up. I missed you. Look at that. You absolutely cut rapid fingers and then takes the Aston off Geno. That, that zero is the, is the, is the play we like. <laughs> Geno, get in the bin. Enjoy your Hass, mate. Right. Um, okay, I'm assuming everyone has managed to get a seat there. So, uh, Axe, Marek, Jesus, Jesus H. Christ. Why do I reckon? Yeah, I don't know. All I'm saying is if Fast Car has signed up, uh, you're going to have to miss this one out. So I don't know if Jesus H. Christ is Fast Car or not. Um, but if I see Fast Car in the lobby, I'm going to have to yeet, I'm afraid. Uh, anyway, Axe, Marek, Jesus H. Christ, and Jack. There's you. There's your name, Jack. Four of you guys. Lobby is open in three... Two, one, go. No, it doesn't let you redeem Bob the Builder. To be honest, Orax, I'm going to be... Oh, guys, guys, that you just reminded me, Orax. I actually put put a um, an email in for the... Uh, like, I'm I'm working on something in the background and I've just put, I've just finalized the, uh, the spec for the new wheel. It's going to be sick. And then we're going to have like a channel points redeem for you guys to choose which wheel I use. Should be sick. I'm really looking forward to it. 
Um, that, that'll be, that's cooking, that's cooking. It, it, it's all confirmed, I'm just waiting at the moment, so. When I can, uh, when I can show that off, I will. And speaking of new wheels as well, Ben actually got one. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's that time of the year, I suppose. Time of the year where the, where the wheels start falling down from the sky. Ben went with a, with a Rexing wheel, which looks very nice. I need to get Ben to get a camera behind his uh, rig, though, so he can actually see it. Uh, we've got 18, by the way. Who hasn't joined for the names I've called out so far? Who hasn't joined? I'm not waiting around too much longer. I'm going to call the next two names if I haven't heard. Uh, anyone here got an MVH wheel? Oh, MVH wheel? Is that the modded wheel, Jets? MVH wheel. Is, is that the modded one for Logitech or no? It is. Yeah, I've seen it. I've not, uh, I've not used it or got it, but I've seen it. I'm pretty sure someone in chat must have an MVH wheel, surely. They look really cool for the, for the amount of money it costs to, to get an F1 style version of the G29. It's pretty sick. Yours coming tomorrow. Nice, mate. Hey, that's awesome. I feel like Logitech are missing a trick, not just like doing a G29 F1 version of their wheel. I know it's a mass market product, not niche, but I, I still feel like loads of people will buy the F1 version, right? Have you seen one of the new ones with the telemetry screens? No, I haven't, to be fair. I haven't. Yeah, that sounds awesome, though. It, anything that works for SimHub, by the way, is a massive W. I'd highly recommend it. So, like, for example, the Moza FSR is not SimHub. I, I personally, if I was spending that money, I would not get the Moza. I would get, um, I would get like, a Leo X1, Le Leox, whatever it's called, something like that, um, or a Cube Controls. But, again, this is, like, a lot more money. Depends what your price bracket is. Who's, who's not in? Who's not in? Who's not in? I'm, I'm scanning chat. Nick says I'm joining now. That's Okay, so that's one then. Cool. So there's only one missing. In that case, uh, Lord Vader, are you in chat? If anyone else, by the way, is still trying to grab a seat and hasn't said anything in chat, it's fine. You can still join, but I'm, you, know, you just got to be quick. Oh, you're there as well, mate. Cool. Right, Lord Vader, you're the last one then. So Lord Vader and uh, anyone else I've called. Uh, Nick, please join the lobby in three, two, one... Open. As always, it's been pretty quick. Honestly, we got we got the community event format on lockdown. I know it takes like 10 minutes, which maybe if you're a viewer, that's a long time just watching the menu. But we can chill and chat in the meantime. And, and considering the, the, you know, the getting the perfect uh, set people in place, it works quite well. One more. Nick's still not joining. Okay. If I do it, if I see anyone but Nick join, I'm going to call the next name on the list. Uh, okay, Downsy, you in chat. Downsy, you in chat. Oh, you're waiting. There you go, mate. Feel free to join. Um, feel free to join, dude. I'm going to open it again in three, two, one. Yeah, we go down the waitlist in order. Guys, it's always fair. That's why I always encourage you guys. The, the bot post it is 6 p.m. every Sunday. So this Sunday... It'll go live for... Is it Japan next week? I feel like it's two weeks. I think next week is a mystery GP. I know Crate Series is back on, but I will be missing Crate Series, sadly. I think it's Brazil for Crate Series. Um, so we will probably do a, a mystery GP next week. Um, but normally it follows the F1 race weekend. Always at 6 o'clock on Sunday, though, the bot posts it. So if you want to get signed up, set a reminder for that on the sign-up channel. Downsy's in. That's 20. Beautiful stuff. Um... Exactly, Jets. It, 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 it's content, and um, even for content, you don't need a wheel like this, but I, I do it because I enjoy it. And, you know, racing with wheels like this and iRacing is, it, and things that can actually use the, the screen and software so well is it, it's awesome. I love it. But it also enhances the content, you know? The wheel cameras is not something that's been done done uh, as effectively before. Oh, who's just like that? All right. Next person, then, is Price. Price or anyone else. Feel free to join Oh, sorry, Price or anyone else that I've called out. Feel free to join in three, two... Oh, wait, it's already open. Never mind. Price is in. All right. I don't know who it was, but... GG's. All right, it's on friends only this time, not invite only. Unpopular opinion. Easter is better than Christmas, says Nitro. Is it possible to ban a mod? Anyone know that? Alright, explain to me why. Why is Easter better than Christmas? 
It's such a simple time of the year. All right, guys, unpopular opinion. Monday the, Monday the 6th of June is, uh, is better than Christmas. It's just such a simple day, you know? <laughs> All right, that'll be good. That'll be good. Yeah, we can ready up, guys. We can ready up. Lobby's ready. <laughs> bad, bad, bad. Are Fanatec wheels worth the money or are Moza better? Um, both are really good, uh, especially for the market they capture. They're like, well, they're, they're high end as well. Personally, if you were going to go pull the trigger on a high end rig, like we're talking a few grand, I would always go Simicube or Acetec. Those would be the two I would go for, not Fanatec. But um, Fanatec are amazing at what they do. And also the game, like, I love that when you plug in Fanatec to the, this game, I'm pretty sure even Moza don't do this, it has everything preset because like they, when they make the F1 games, they test it with Fanatec gear. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty confident that is correct. Um, I'm like 95% sure. Uh, so yeah, naturally it's always going to feel pretty good on a Fanatec wheel. Um, but we're talking F1, which is not a sim sim game if we're talking i racing or like realism i would uh i can't pick between fanatec or moza personally i'd probably go fanatec just from previous experience with the brand but i know these days they take a long time to reply and customer services can be a bit flaky with how how popular they are yeah what vader said fanatec is a bad rep right now it's um waiting time in customer service isn't it if i'm if i'm remembering correctly but you know I personally had big issues with Moza. I will say that. I, I bought the Moza FSR, FSR wheel from them and just had awful comms from their customer service and ended up returning it. The whole process took like over a month. Um, I, yeah, at the time I was, I was fuming. I was sharing that with you guys, but you never know. You know, there are other creators that, that rock Moza and absolutely love it. So um, it's one of those where you want to make your own informed opinion on that stuff. I would personally lean towards a CSL DD or something, but I would uh, not blame anyone if they went for like a Moza R9 instead. Uh, right, so it is going to be a dry session. It is going to be a dry session. Guys, Inters, remember, if you're going straight out, make sure you do an Inters lap. I want to see an Inters lap from you at Australia. Remember, track limits here are bugs. Don't be squeezing each other off the track. They are very bugged here. You get instant penalties instead of warnings. Um, and be careful of the speed bump. Be careful of the, uh, the, the invisible bump, uh, the, uh, the second, sorry, the third DRS into the 90 degree right-hander after the end of sector two. Oh no, is it start of sector three? I think it might be start of sector three. Another more important debate. Can we all agree Australia is the worst track on the game by a huge margin? Are you saying that, Geno, because of the bugs and issues or are you just generally saying that for the track because if you're saying that about the track i disagree I, I like australia i think it's a good track but i just it's just not very drivable at the moment hungry is worse later i'll give you a virtual handshake for that i completely agree that's something i can vibe with oh wait what am i doing i've gone way too far have i got a setup for this I don't think I do. 11th of Jan. Right, let's have a look then. Let's pull up. Let's pull an SRC setup. It's obviously dry. So, um, let's see. Remember, make sure you do an Inters lap, guys. I'm going to go out on the Inters shortly. Let me check this. Mm. Okay. Setup's pretty good, to be honest. Looks good. I'm not going to mess with tire pressures. Keep those the same. I think this was a setup I ran for the... Oh, yeah, of course. This would have been a similar setup to what I ran um, in the preview race earlier in the week against the 110 AI, where they were just like stupidly quick I, I think they were they, they were really quick on the straights and then still through the high speed corners they were rapid as well I 
But compared to AI, this is this is a little bit high wing, but I think to be honest, what we're running is absolutely fine. <laughs> you guys really think Christmas is better than Easter? Alright, let's settle this once and for all. Before I go before I go out, let's settle this once once and for all, right? I'm doing it I'm doing a one off poll. One one off poll on Twitch chat. Right. Which one is better? Um, we this this is this is it. We're we're settling this. It's sure. It's, I mean, come on. It can't even be. It can't even be a question. Right. There you go. One for Christmas, two for Easter. Chat. Which one's better? I can't believe some of you say Easter. You, you you're insane. One for Christmas, two for Easter. Which one's better? Right, and now we're in, and we'll go out and do some driving in the meantime. Oh, inters. Get me on the inters, please. There we go. Lovely stuff. Okay, engine's fired up. Which one's better, chat? Christmas or... No way some of you guys are voting Easter. Are you all right? Seriously? Is this a thing? People actually prefer Easter over Christmas. Why? Think about the Easter eggs. What about Christmas, uh, the chocolate at Christmas? What about the Christmas dinner? That's better than the chocolate. Come on. Christmas dinner bangs. And if it doesn't bang for you, you're doing it wrong. Oh, that, oh yeah, that sounds really wrong. Oh, I forget I said that. Christmas is longer. Yep, yep. Another good point. Oh, wait, hold up. <laughs> Teammate, are we good? <laughs> I've, I've looked at chat. I've looked back and I've seen an Aston sideways. I'm cutting, so Christmas dinner is a no-go. Well, then in that case, Easter chocolate's a no-go as well, right? I'm cutting as well, to be fair. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm bulking. It's bulk season for me. I ate like loads of uh, Haribo and um, and frazzles and crisps and stuff today. Got to get my bulk on, you know. I've been bulking for the last like six years, chat. It's mad. I'm like the opposite of Fabio. Fabio's got this like mad gym routine. No, so do I, but I just, I'm just like, I'm constant bulk, you know. I get taught from... Uh, it taught from Ben Daly himself. Oh God! <laughs> nice, nice wide, wide entry to the lap. Chocolate doesn't count. Yeah, it does. What do you mean? I'll make up my own bulk, mate. Hey, I tell you what, that felt fairly clean. Oh, that drift wasn't good. This doesn't feel like the worst lap in the world. I can't lie. Oh, that wasn't good. Why did I say that? I lost loads of time through there. But that sector one honestly wasn't bad. I'm going to say that and I'm going to be about 40 seconds slower than Jeddo in sector one. But for me, it felt decent. Oh, that was late. You cut so much of that inside curb, but because I went late on the brakes, it compromised my exit. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, no! Oh, I would have invalidated then if I didn't brake. We've just scuffed the lap now. All right. What is that then? 121. Oh! As fast as, is that fast as on Inters? Is that Inters pole? Later, smokes. Sorry, I got a bit too excited there. Sorry, Later. That was rude. You went indoor go-karting yesterday. Hey, nice. 
and I'll be doing that tomorrow as well. I'm looking forward to that. I haven't been indoor go-karting since um, Dortmund. Dortmund Sim Expo last year. Well, I just, I don't know. I saw you in here with the leaderboard. I was like, right, late out having it. <laughs> Couldn't resist. <laughs> hey, Nitro Jello, where you at? What is this? It's disgraceful. Why are you letting me beat you? What's going on? They definitely haven't done a lap yet, have they? Oh, very good. There's Yellow. <laughs> there he is. Right on time. Someone's gone ahead, but they're definitely on slicks because Timo was a 17-9, so... Right, I'm ending the poll, by the way, when I get back, to, back into the pits. So if you haven't voted, chat, which is better, Easter or Christmas? One is Christmas, two is Easter. I can't believe so many are voting Easter, to be honest, but... I'll be ending it in a moment. So yeah, if you haven't pressed one or two, you better vote. Some people either have really bad Christmas or amazing Easters. Yeah, that's true. Actually, that's a good point. That is very true. Thank you so much, Artemis, for the 20 month three sub. I appreciate that. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Maybe, like, maybe for you, Easter is like a, a real family time. Someone did say that in chat. I, I saw that comment. Um,. For me, like my family, when, when, like when I was, when I was at home as a kid, we would do the typical like Easter eggs and whatever, and occasionally, sometimes we might do like a Sunday Easter dinner or something. But it was never like celebrated. It was like, oh, you know, maybe some games if you're, if if you're a young kid of like you know, um, Easter egg hunt or something like that. But otherwise, Christmas was like so much bigger. Easter is cheaper. Okay, I mean that's fair. Yeah, if you're a parent in chat, then, then maybe you prefer Easter for that reason. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you what, that's a that's a crazy gap. But by my standards, six tenths off Jello on Inters. Honestly, that lap didn't feel. Look at that sector one, bro. I'm telling you, that, that felt good. It was sector three where I had to uh, break on one of the corners. I understood wide. I lost a heap there. Yeah, I lost most of my time in sector three. I only lost a tenth. I only lost eight hundredths to general sector one, then a tenth and a half, and then uh, and then like over three tenths in sector three. Okay, track's busy. Be aware. We playing after stream? Not pro clubs, mate. Not pro clubs. I can't. I uh, I'll be I'll be preparing for tomorrow, and uh, well, yeah, preparing for tomorrow. Either sorting the house or um or i racing. Would I show? Hey, where's your lap? How dare you? How dare you disgrace the Inter Championship? You got a 21-0 to beat, mate. You need a you need a 20 to get Inter's pole. Okay, we're 20 in the speed trap. Oh, seven tenths on Lita. Oh, oh, baby. Hello. 10% <laughs> wear, by the way, on those tires. Jesus. Can I do two laps here, guys? I don't think I can. I'm going to go straight out. I don't think I can do two laps, but I'm going to see what we can do. Are you watching quality? No, probably not, Ellis. I won't be able to, mate. With the schedule tomorrow, I just think it'll end up mudding my, my sleep. Oh, can you win the poll? Yeah, sorry. Oh, so, yeah, I completely forgot about that. So the, the poll results were Christmas, but to be fair, 35% of people that voted said East is better. I was expecting a lot less than that. Got to be careful on this pit exit because it's so easy to get tangled with someone going for the very fast turn one. Nice little toe there for the Mercedes. That wasn't ideal. Probably should have just done that corner and run wide. Six minutes on the clock. I mean, we might be able to. I don't know if we will. Okay, just two laps of fuel remaining now. Red Bull's on the lap as well. I've not got anywhere near enough heat in my tyres, by the way. They're still mid-80s. Not cooking.
Come on! Get the heat! Get the heat! Oh, that's a little bit better. All right, we can start a lap now. See what we can do. I've got no idea what lap times are good here. Genuinely, done no practice whatsoever. There he goes. That was bad. Oh dear. Oh, it's a slow sector one. Mess up that left hander. The sixth year for the right hander? It might be. I hope my wings are okay. I hope the straight line speed is good. See how much you can cut that inside chicane. A bit late on the power there. It's an all right lap. Ah, oh, not even in the sixteens. It'll do. Okay, we haven't got enough time to do the one. Rain? I mean, that won't be in the session, but interesting. I wonder whether that could happen in the race. I really messed up this uh, this left-hander here. 100% messed that one up. GB taking esports lines. That's what I was saying to you guys, though, because a lot of... A lot of people were like, oh, trap limits, trap limits on uh, on Monday in the preview race because I was taking a lot of that chicane, but I couldn't really explain it at the time because I was running regular, but you really can cut that chicane legally. <laughs> it's just like weaving around. <laughs> What's Nero doing? <laughs> I was like, where's he going? <laughs> it's just like weaving around in front of me. Well, we've got a five-phase group LC. I was going to start for the back anyway, but... <laughs> yeah, i got a five-phase group LC. I don't know what... Yeah, I did... There were there, uh, our teammates been... having a few alcoholic beverages there. Definite, definite bit of drink driving going on in Sector 2. Oh, what's the speed limit? All right, 79. Wait, really? That's... Oh. Genuinely don't think I've driven more than two hours of this track yet. It's, uh, I like the track, mate. Oh, what did you say earlier? Is it because of the bugs on the issues with the track or you just not like it? I, I like the track. I think it flows nicely, but... Adam uh, Adam Carbonin, by the way. Thanks for the follow, mate. Appreciate it. Welcome in. Once again, I really appreciate the, uh, the, the subs as well. Artemis, Sir Dogan, Absolute Legends. Renee, Golf, Kev, Barnsey. Appreciate it. Or a teammate bit, bit him off. Nah, zero, zero's cooking. Let zero cook. So we're expecting Jenna with a 16-6. Oh, uh, my sector two was all right then. Okay, interesting. Oh my God, look at that sector three. Jesus. Half a second off. All right, interesting. Very interesting. My sector two actually wasn't that bad, was it? Sector one was bad though. I made that mistake. The sector one should have been all right. Um, I mean, three tenths off Geno, but should have been uh, quicker than pretty much it. anyone else. Sector one. Sector three was bad, though. I lost so much time, though. Am I just breaking too early or something? Very strange. Track good, track limits bad. The fast left right I did was disgusting. As in, oh, okay, disgusting as in bad, I'm guessing, with the 17.5. 
So you got a bit of time in that. Yeah, I, I, something was telling me about... Because my first reaction when I crossed the line was like, wow, not even a 16. No, something was telling me that a 16 is, a, is what, you, what to aim for. The following might have done this in Great Series once upon a time. I think we were scheduled to do this actually in this game, but we cancelled it. I think we said we... Yeah, I think we were going to do it, and then we changed our minds because of the issue with the track limits. That would have been a mess if we did it in Crate Series, for sure. I'm glad we didn't. Nitro with a 16-3. 17-5, Sector 2 as well. Did you have a mistake there? Nitro, 6 tenths quicker, Sector 3. What am I doing wrong? Holy crap. Sector 1, I, I, know, I know there's a bit of time there, but Sector 3, Jesus. That's insane. Hey, fair play. I, that means I'm technically starting P10, but I think we'll probably, uh, I think we'll probably go to the back anyway, guys. Gave up on quality. I've been doing practice for a couple of sessions, but this fit, it's feeling a bit more nervous. Hey, all good, all good. All good. You know, Gray as well. Appreciate the follow. Welcome in. Um, and again, warm well, welcome to anyone tuning in. Happy Friday as we see the Hass of Jello just stack it in the wall beautifully there. Oh, why didn't I disqualify myself? I should have disqualified myself. Damn it. You guys taught me that trick last time and I forgot it. All right, never mind. We're going we're gonna to watch all the Turn 1 chaos at the start of the race. Uh, this is our community event, our Friday night finale. 50% race coming up, 29 laps of Australia. We've got increased red flags, and we've got standard safety car, I'm pretty sure. The fast left right is actually impossible. You just need to cut it loads. Well, maybe I just didn't... I'm sure I didn't maximize it, but I don't find that chicane too, too hard. I think the trick of the, the fast left right is to, to, to get it tucked in on the left as much as you can. Because then you can just straighten up the, the chicane, cut it, and still get a good exit. I mean, you already know this, I'm sure, but I quite like that. So in the end, we got three 16s from uh, Nitro, Geno, and Timo. Um, we qualify technically P6, but we, it is P11 on the grid thanks to the uh, collision with our teammate. Um but we will be dropping to the back at the start of the race. Let's see what the strategy is for Australia. Um, I'm trying to remember the race, the preview race we did earlier in the week. I think that was a two or a three stop. I think boxing here is actually okay. I think fresh tires gains you a bit. We only use one set of softs in, the, in that quality session there, so that means we'll have two, I think, for the race. Do not use hards, all you need to know, says Nitro. Well, we've got two softs, two mediums, so I think we're cooking for that. <laughs> okay, well, do. <laughs> do not use hards unless you're Nitro or Geno, because you can just get away with it. Yeah, I mean, it is saying use hards on here, but... Hmm, let's see. We have spare softs. I'm going to go break even on fuel because I have no idea what, what the actual strat is on fuel. Uh, I don't think we burn much when we do the preview. I'm going to go soft medium or what's... Two stop is actually viable, chat. Jesus. But we'd need to box on lap eight if we do that. All right. <clears throat> Start on the soft tires. Let's do it. That just says, in fact, use hard. So we're a bit late for that now, mate. <laughs> I will be dropping for the back. Dropping to the back and then trying to make some moves. That's the strat, guys. Okay, how was that pull away? Gonna have a bit more grip than Very that good. start, but we need to warm the tires properly now. Make sure you get some heat and it's disqualified, he wants those 69 degree tires. If you guys want 69, just make sure you disqualify or Yeah, disqualify from formation lap. Gave Jeno a 69. <laughs> oh, dearie me. What have we started? Do you, mean, do you think the Top Gun theme is good? Yeah? I like the Top Gun theme? I feel like that's one of those questions where I'm walking into a trap, just knowing you guys, but probably isn't. I was watching practice, just realised this, but Ozzy had the shortest pit lane on the calendar. Was practice just on just now or something? Is, is FP3 already done? Or no? It must be done, though. 
I'm so out of sync with the with the Australia sessions. Oh no, last night. Right, okay. Wait, FP3 is 1 a.m. Oh my god. Oh, I might actually watch that. I will most likely still be awake then. In fact, I'll almost certainly still be awake then. Yeah, straight after the stream, guys, I'm going to prepare for tomorrow with iRacing and um, and just in general. We'll make sure make sure we're ready. I'm looking forward to tomorrow. Get a reminder for you guys as we're lining up for the start of the race that um, we will be doing the 12-hour endurance race of Sebring tomorrow with uh, I believe with myself makes it eight creators from Creator Series. Alex Skillen and Ben Daly will be round my house and we'll be doing a three-hour stint combined in my rig. I will be literally lifting Ben in and out of the rig. If you want to see it, make sure you tune in for around about four o'clock UK time uh, tomorrow. I'm sure it's going to be as chaotic as it sounds, just like this race. Are you streaming the whole 12 hours? No, we... I would actually like to stream more tomorrow. I would I would like to watch like Tom's POV, for example, and some of the others. But um, we've got the girls over as well. So the six of us, we've got other plans. So it'll just be uh, go-karting first, come straight back, jump in the rig, do Sebring, and then pretty much end up at around about seven. I'll be watching the guys though and uh, cheering them on in the background. Here we go. I say that, we're going to drop to the back. Nacho and Jenna coming with us as well. Right, that is last place with our teammate. Squeeze and pass. We went very slow there into turn one for that same reason, for, for that exact reason. Fuel is showing is, oh my god, Jesus, that was ridiculously early in the brakes. That's how crashes happen. Oh, there's a car spun. Squeezing around the outside, making early moves. All right, they're going to burn the battery. That's fine. We'll let them do it. I'll show you further back on the hards cutting his way through as well. This is survival mode when you start this far back. That's lovely. So exactly how you do it. Just keep to the left, far left as you can of that. The start of the chicane. Straighten up the exit. Oh my god. Leaving space on the exit and run him off. Making some early moves here. Are we going to be able to get this or no? Check out, you're right. You're in the top ten now, keep it up. Oh, Checo versus Nacho, that's gonna go well. So a very good start chat, we're up to P9, we're actually we're actually higher than where we started before we dropped to the back. Oh, I was slow. Oh, I should have been 50 death, that's right. Boss battle, Checo. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, Nick, I, I said earlier, mate. Yeah, that's where we're going. Oh, that was a little bit too much on the brakes. We can get the McLaren of Ellis here. It's a good exit. Oh, why didn't I break? Running very well. So far, so good. Late out sets the fastest lap. Okay, DRS is now available. Oh, that was a warning. Yeah, not good, chat. Not good. You don't want to be flirting with track limits around here. And we are using a bit of fuel as well. Put the drivers in front under a bit of pressure. These softs are taking a pounding chat. 12% already. Oh my word. 
deck is no joke. So Dogen goes very wide there. We're just chilling at the moment. Biding our time. We've got hard tyres in front of Sir Dogen, so we may need to make a move. If he doesn't. Oh, no. I've got a slightly better exit there than we'd be cooking. I might send this. Well defended. Oh, we can still get the move, though. We've got the extra grip on the inside. And there's a VSC. We just snuck ahead as the VSC came out. I tell you what, I'm impressed we managed nearly three racing laps, to be honest. <laughs> oh, do I, I think, still think it's too early to box, even with the VSC. If it's a full safety car, I will. At the moment, no safety car, though. We do have one driver, but ICU is boxed. Very interesting. I see a damage. That's an interesting call. Hey, Mr. Alex with the tier two. Let's go, dude. GB, this is gingerly command. We need you to increase lift and coast. Repeat lift and coast or we'll turn your engine off. This is gingerly command. Is that, is that like Ben Daly command or something? What's going on? Thank you so much, mate, for the 34 month tier two. Absolute legend. Any uh, progress on the S2K? You're still uh, still hunting for one, right? Can't believe how much they are. It's crazy. I spoke I spoke to you about it with the uh, spoke to my mate about it who um, who wrote off his one at the ring that I told you about. Because I literally I hit him up and I was like, Jesus! I got I got a mate who's looking to buy a uh, an S2K and they're this price, and he was like, Wow, crazy! Okay, how? BSC no 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 no! Oh my god, that was very close. That was that was that was very close. Oh white. Oh boy. No doubt we got good pace. Got a really good grip off that final corner. That was close. <laughs> oh my god. Can we get the jump here. That was a big send. I had to do it. We kept it fair. No contact. Okay, good work. Great pass. Certainly 10 out of 10 for aggression there. Guys, we're up to P4. Oh, my word. What a start that has been. Jesus. I really just realized. I thought we were, like, chilling around P8 or something. Went from back of the grid to P4 in, what, four laps? It's a solid start. And now we'll get off the soft and we'll go onto the medium tire, I think. That was a, that was a ballsy move on the hard tires behind us because we had to hope that he wasn't going to fight it too hard. He obviously wanted to defend, but... When I went for the late send, he didn't try and uh, do anything silly, so. Fair racing all round. I was 10,000th from getting a drive for. Yeah, dude. I don't know when yours was, Jenna, but I was on the fast left right chicane at the moment it was ending. So I was like, oh my God. I was so close to overcooking. Is it medium set? Let's see. Yeah. Right, there we go. All right, then. We've got one warning. We've got to keep it clean on the warnings. We really do. Medium tire on. Lovely stuff. Okay, mate. That's it. Go. Go, go. Perfect job on the turn in there, Lovely stuff then, chat. We come out in... Wait, did someone stay out? You only have to stop once now. One stop left. Someone must have stayed out if we're P5, right? Who stayed out? I thought it was like General Nitro. Nitro P8. He has boxed. Wait, what? Who jumped me? I see you stayed out. Oh, he's already boxed. Oh, of course he boxed under the VSC. So I see you's on mediums, but he is going to be on worse wear. Interesting. Is he P1? Do I see his P1? No, P2. Okay, later. You're loving life right now. I made some really nice moves with the charge. Thank you. Yeah, it's been a, it's been a good start. Being too, not being too bad at all. That is, I will say it's been an area of my racing I've been trying to work on. I'm fully aware that in the Crate series, I'm 
known as being one of the more kind of generally speaking i know i've made some mistakes in recent races don't get me wrong michi hoyer and imola razan in china but generally speaking i'm not known for being the aggressive driver right but i'm trying to adapt a little bit there are certain areas where we need to be a little bit more assertive in some situations in an area of my racing i'll be trying to work on and that of, of course naturally helps with, against ai if you can bully the ai especially you guys see it in four player cart with the online ai with how crazy they are if you can bully those then uh, you end up doing so well. Hey, thank you, Care, with a 12 month reset. Absolute legend. Appreciate it, mate. Nitro is in P8 at the moment on fresh tires. So he'll, I'm sure he'll be cutting through the pack on the restart. Got this. Sir Dogan's got hard tires. Interesting. Very interesting. Wait, what did you do, Nitro? I didn't need to double stack Iron Moses. Oh, did you get the glitch pit stop? Did you get the glitch? Oh, you absolute gremlin. You did a Yano in the Mercedes. Thank you so much for the 12 month, dude. I appreciate that, man. The anniversary. Legend. Yeah, Alex, look forward to it, mate. I hope you, uh, hope you post whatever updates on the, in the car chat. I do, I do check it. Even if I'm like 24 hours late sometimes. That's one thing, guys. If you ever want to reach out or share share, uh, share any dubs or whatever, then uh, pop it in the Discord. I'm, I'm very active on that. Fuel's burning back down. I think we were... Mm, I don't know if we were using much fuel, were we? But we can have it about break even. I'll let it creep back up across this lap. Safety cars in this lap. The whole pack has caught the car already. And in fact, I will say... The quality of this race so far has been really good. Maybe maybe some incidents further back. I'm not saying it's been perfectly clean. Clearly not if there's a safety car, but the fact that we're all bunched up at this stage, no one half a lap behind the safety car, which we usually have. It's been, uh, it's been pretty good. Kill says I'll try work together if I can keep up. Yeah, it sounds good, mate. It sounds good. Safety car in this lap. I'll be looking safety to uh, in just... Try and latch onto the leaders if I can. Late hat is no slouch. She'll be uh, she'll be flying on the restart. You're always mis Mr. Consistent from this Creative Series Collins box. Yeah, I feel yeah I feel like that's pretty fair. I feel like I'm generally pretty consistent. Just need to um, a couple couple things of my own game I need to work on, but. get a good restart here late out is uh a nice slow one here safety car is now already in we can go at any point there we go already nope okay, clear. that's a good turn one that's a very good turn one. I would have P3. Sorry, P4. <laughs> hey, GB, who it's been a pleasure of three of following you. Seeing hey, you legend, Oliver. Every Saturday in the Bobmobile and seeing you grow to become the Aston oh. Martin F1 esports content creator and butterfly. Dot hey, GB, carry on the hard work. <laughs> butterfly, <laughs> what? <laughs> Thank you, Oliver. I appreciate it. Thank you for the kind words. We are P4 currently. Full safety car is out, so we won't be doing anything here. Not quite sure what happened there. There's an Alpine and a Red Bull further back. Um, I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna just use my crystal ball real quick to. Mm, oh, it's a Giga Chad Checo incident uh, further back. So, um, not quite sure what happened there, but my crystal ball has confirmed it's a Giga Chad Checo incident. What a save! Geno's playing FIFA. I see you seem slightly slow. He's on used tyres. I see. Oh, there we go. He's boxing now. Right decision. He'll lose loads of positions. Yes, but he's on the back foot for tyres. I think. I think you take it at this point. 
Guys, I'm pretty sure mediums will go to the end, by the way. I don't think it's optimum. I'm not sure if that's what we do. But I think from here, it's going to be close between whether we go medium soft or just mediums. In which case, Berkey and anyone else on hard could be cooking. Jenna tried something optimistic. <laughs> I just love blaming, blaming Checo. <laughs> I love it. Because I, I know it's a nibble every time. <laughs> Mediums puncture at 19-ish laps. Okay, very good. <laughs> All right. Well, it's a good job we're not doing 22 laps on them then. <laughs> I think minor safety cars, it will be roughly 19 laps, won't it? A little bit more. Yeah, Jesus. What are we on now? 5%? Really? That, that doesn't seem right. Damn. Check you out later with the strats. Hello. Sweaty, sweaty later. <laughs> Check out always in the wall. Bless him. Yeah, exactly. Oh, Shaken, thanks for the follow as well. I appreciate it. Welcome in, welcome in. Lap 9 of 29. And this is uh, num safety car number two. I believe we can get five safety cars, unless I'm mistaken. Wait, hang on. Did we have a VSC? This might technically be number three, actually. Oh, yeah, no, we did have a VSC. We had a full VSC as well, because that didn't convert into a safety car. I think we had a VSC, and then we had a VSC into safety car, and now we've got a safety car. I don't know whether that means we've only got one left. I think it still means we've got two left. But we definitely have red flags as well. That's on increased. So we could get those at any point. Jimski says more than five is possible. And at 50%, I don't think it is, is it? I don't think it is. Yeah, this is number. Th this is definitely number three. I was thinking three or four, but I think it's three. I didn't think more than five was possible in a, in a 50. In a 100, I think it's six. I believe it's six or possibly seven, but I think it's six. You know, Louis gets him back away. Oh, you had six. Okay, all right. I don't know. We can definitely get five safety cars and then red flags. So, yeah. Um, we might be P3 now, but there can be many more twists than this. Safety car will be in this lap as well. Uh, Hydra says you can get six, I believe. Okay. All right. In that case, we've used up half. Oh, what's up, Dak, as well? Welcome in. See you using the specs. We'll be getting a new wheel soon, which is uh, exciting. I've, I've customized it with the, uh, with the manufacturer. I literally did that a couple of days ago, I think. And then once, once it's arrived, we'll unbox it on stream, um, have a look at it, and, uh, and we'll make it a points command so you guys can choose which wheel. You will, GSI. I will, I will share with you as soon as it's here. It's going to be a new exciting partnership. Oh my god, my fronts are over 100. Roasting. Safety car in now. There we go. That was always going to be a late one. Right, here goes then. Um, let's get straight on it. Oh, wait. I've only just realized LaTeX got a three-second penalty. I don't know when that was. move on. Timo defended that well. A little bit of a wobble there from the house. Oh, jeez. I'll dip it in the grass as well. That's not good. Oh, my. <laughs> We're on the edge there. Got to be careful. What's our straight line speed like, though? That is the question. I'm not using battery, and I am gaining on late but it is slipstream. So, probably not too much different. 
Oh my god! That was way too much of the left curb. We might be in trouble here. That was bad. Kill's not going to send it. Legends. That was a really bad left right if you get too far on the curb. That is what happens. Team are all out of shape there. But our pace is good, chat. We're ticking along nicely. There's Nitro. That. I've got some for you, so go check your MFT. Your well, I'll just slow turn one. Five point one go on, give me the strat then. Copy. All right. Nitro's flying. I do think our straight line speed is pretty good. Nice move. Good job. That was close. That was close, but we got the move done. Oh, I hit the bump. Do you guys see it? That's the bump I talked to you guys about. Timo's done a switch back. That's the bump I'm talking to you about, though. I hit that bump and lost. Big bit of momentum. And this fighting is helping late out massively. Late out six seconds. Okay, the stewards have now enabled DRS. DRS is now online. That's a big fight with Timo. Very big fight. I want to try and catch late out now. Pace is good. Holy cook. Oh my god, are we just getting three tenths? Whoa, did I just get DRS? Oh my god, the pace through sector one then was nuts. Oh, that was beautiful. All right. That was just what we needed. Wow. I thought we were going to be a sitting duck to Timo. Not bad at all, not bad at all. We're all over the back of late out now, or we will be shortly. Battery's not ideal, I know. But we're now in a good position. Oh, I'm in the grass! No! I hit the grass! Oh, if you do that on this track, it's GG. Oh, no. We're still in a good position, but that was far from ideal. So much for consistent there. Geno and Nitro behind. To the two drivers you don't want to see in your mirrors. Late at struggling though, I think. At least it seemed like it. Late out went wide there. Oh, another safety car already! Strat, guys, strat. What are we saying? Hashtag bottled. Yeah, dude. I really did bottle that one. I was such an unnecessary little dip into the grass as well. As soon as you do that, it's, it's GG. I think I should just hit you then. <laughs> I was red on the Delta, to be fair. I think we go mediums, chat. I think we go mediums. Time to go on the mediums. Okay, slow down, slow down. Your delta's negative, which means you're going too fast. Reduce your pace. Who's going to stay out, I wonder? Anyone? No one. No one's staying out yet. Smart. Oh, no. Who's the Haas? Jeddo. Jeddo in the mud. Jeddo in the mud. 
We nearly jumped Timo, by the way. Jeno lost, I think, two positions at least. Oh, Checo's out. GG's. So about this being a clean race. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. There's always going to be incidents to some degree, but... I mean, obviously, from my perspective, it's been a good race. I'm sure further back has been a little bit chaotic, but... We definitely had a good start, and then it seems that <laughs> the, grid's, the grid's got a little bit too excited in the last uh, handful of laps. Ain't that tire wear masterclass in Kevin? Oh my god, Leto and Softs! <laughs> Shad said Softs, and she was like, yep, that's the, that is the strat right there. That is the strat. Good luck later. <laughs> Le Le you literally said mediums do 19 laps. Why would you go on softs? I mean, they'll make it. But they're going to be they're going to be hurting at the end. I mean, you got six seconds, I suppose. Not like you got too much to lose. But you never know. Chat, we're all, I think I'm on one warning. And like I said, this track is notorious for buggy track limits. Later, have you had an instant penalty out of interest? Because you did. I felt like you jumped from three straight to six on the safety car restart. I don't know if you had any bugged uh, limits or something. Let me have a look. First, first three was instant. Oh, my God. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Penalty plus four warnings. Penalty plus three warnings. So, basically, you probably hit track limits twice, lap one, but then one was a bug. And then it looks like it's given you an instant penalty here. Oh, I don't know. Maybe that one's legit, but that definitely looks like buggy to me. Yeah, that's unfortunate, Leta. I'm sure some of you guys as well have been struck by that. Just be careful, especially Sector 1. Do not abuse track limits, Sector 1. I'll show you which, which left-hander it is, but there's one that's particularly bad that I remember Dale was getting uh, instant penalties in four-player. It is the left-hander after this. It's this left-hander here, and obviously cars can go side by side here, and you often see it the one on the, the inside squeezes to the outside. If you run that white line, I think it's white, not yellow. If you run the track limits there, you'll likely get an instant penalty. Yeah, I know. It's unfortunate that hasn't been fixed. It's frustrating. Safety car will be in this lap, by the way. We'll have 13 laps of racing, chat. On these medium tyres, it's the perfect strat to the end of the race, to be honest. Uh, but yeah, TK is saying, uh, in theory, softs will be 14 laps until puncture. So that's what I mean. I think Latat will make it to the end without... It should be without an issue, but she will probably just be very slow. Latat is never a slouch. He's always very quick. I think even for later, that's going to be a stretch. Let's see. We've got some hungry drivers behind. We've got Jeddo and Nitro on the move. We've got a Timo as well in front. It was looking very quick as well. Leitat should fly on this restart. We might struggle to keep with her initially. And then after about maybe five or six laps is when she'll begin to struggle. Are we going to get an early restart? Is she going to try and use those tires? If I was her, I would go for an early restart. But let's see. Oh, why am I getting so many marbles, man? It's so annoying. I'm trying to stay on the freaking racing line. Uh, Nitro? What happened? Oh, what was that turn one? That was horrible. Let's try and stay close. That looked like she had a wobbly rear there. When doesn't she? Oh, that was close to a warning. Okay, Lifted ever so slightly, which I think saved it. Timo's going straight for the move. He knows. 
Fight it, Latak. Come on, fight it. Oh, contact. We're chilling. I think I'm diving too late on the brakes there. Damn it, Nacho. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 8.8 .8 seconds. P4 having fastest lap on a safety car restart is impressive. I think it's because of the gap he left final corner. Yeah, this is good, chat. I'm not stretching the legs too much, and we are comfortably staying behind. It's a good sign for the end. Uh, Nitro will obviously have a bundle of pace, though, once he's released. I felt like we got that left-right pretty much nailed down, to be honest. Oh, what is that? Four tenths. Lady could be a sitting duck here. But we're gonna have to stay with Timo because Timo's quick. Breaking a little bit earlier now as we're very close to the cars in front. Very slow exit. Stay with you, mate. That was far from ideal. Oh, bit slidey. Marbles, marbles. Go on, stay with T boat. Four tenths. It's good. Oh, later, that's a mistake. Not just three. Assuming that was a mistake and they won't go side by side. Timo with a big moment. Jesus, he gained massively there. Oh, another safety car! Oh my god! Oh, this is not helping anyone with penalties. Jesus. Right. All right. Ooh, it's soft, chat? I don't know. What do we do? I mean, if we stay out, our tyres are comfortably making it to the end. And if we stay out for track position, our tyres comfortably make it. Obviously, if these guys box, they'll lose positions to the cars further back. I think for track position, it's worth staying out. Only losing two. I don't know. If everyone boxes, it's going to be a huge amount of losses. Oh, Timo! Why can't you take the bait? Huh? Come on. <laughs> Why couldn't you bottle?
Oh, Jeno again. Oh, my God. It's beautiful. Inject it. Inject it. <laughs> oh, Lord Vader stayed out. Oh, my God. Darth Vader himself is leading the race. So hopefully he's got some sort of trick up his sleeve. Sticks his lightsaber into Tebow and holds him up. <laughs> Not sure Leitao was struggling. Well, on the softs, it felt like uh, it felt like the pace wasn't quite there. But I don't know. We're about to find out if the if, if the softs are cooking in the race or not. Um, what we do know from the early stint is that they fall off very quickly. They fall off very quickly. So like, I think we're talk like we will end the race at over twenty five percent. But obviously, nobody around us will be on better tyres, or if, if they are, it's going to be negligible. Soft medium crossover is four laps, really? Oh, maybe we would have been better off going on mediums. I mean, I don't have any, but... Damn. This is my last lot of tyres, guys. If there's another safety car, I do think we have to stay out, and then we may really be in trouble. So we're net P2 at the moment. Lord Vader has not boxed. He will be an absolute sitting duck to pretty much all the drivers behind. We just got to hope we can get through relatively unscathed. He's going to have to time his safety guard restart here because if he does it right, he can keep the lead into turn one. But if he allows Timo to sit right behind, uh, well, it could be a problem. Timo could easily get a second clear of us. Need to keep the RS. Yeah, exactly. I, I, I'm hoping Lord Vader is not going to be the, uh, the cork in the bottle that releases Timo. We will see. We will see. We are going to have, I uh, believe, seven laps of racing. Safety car should be in next lap. It should be seven laps of racing by the time it comes in. So softs will be, I reckon softs will be about 40%-ish by the end. We'll see. I beg you never say that again. I don't even know what that was I said, to be honest. <laughs> uh, J Money, by the way, appreciate the follow. Welcome in. Once again, if you do enjoy the content, as always, make sure you smash a follow button or subscribe button wherever you are, whatever platform you're watching on. Appreciate you guys, as always. We will be live tomorrow for the 12-hour endurance race. My first ever stream on iRacing, actually, um, will be tomorrow. And my first ever, you know, certainly endurance race or competitive race on iRacing. Hey, TK with the tier one sub legend, dude. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. No more ads for you, mate. Get them in the bin. Thank you so much. I appreciate the tier one. We'll be underway on this lap. Uh, we need to... Oh, mm, fuel's a little bit low. Let that top up a bit before we brake drag. Let's go lean and then we'll start getting back on the brake drag at the end of the lap. Told the ads to box box, exactly. Yeah, I, I ads bug me as well. If I could sub to every channel, I would. Twitch Turbo is good for that, to be fair. The best thing with Twitch Turbo as well, I don't know how many of you guys knew this or not, but um, if you if you subscribe for Twitch Turbo, um, uh, you obviously get no ads in every channel, but the creator that you're watching still gets ad revenue. It's really good. Uh, I remember checking my ad revenue section once, and it literally lists Twitch Turbo separately. Because ad revenue these days is, is quite a nice way of supporting. But um, enough about ad revenue. We are about to restart this race. That time I uh, chop that down. Lord Vader is getting us underway. Where's he going to go? I would run this right to the line if I was him, but let's see. Nope, he's gone already. And this is why I said it's a bad idea. Because he's going to be... Oh, I don't know. Is he going to fight it? He's going to fight it. Oh, my... Bit of contact there. Mm, with, with plenty of space. We've got a lot of spare energy. Okay, to we have to keep up with Timo, guys. It's going to be so quick. Same that slip stream. Battery management is crucial from here. 
Straight on speed's good. Very good. Marbles. Marbles are so horrible here, Jesus. Not you're just casually taking half a second out sector three. Okay, be aware the car behind is catching you by five tenths a lap, five tenths. Alright, team of P1 at the moment with P2. Nacho and DRS at the moment, it's a three car race. Plenty of laps to go though. Plenty of twists. Oh, that was really bad. Oh, hey, thank you so much for the raid, Dana. Welcome in, guys. He joined us at the end of our community event in Australia. Only five and a half laps to go, and we are in the fight for a P1 here. Again, a big lift into here. I underestimate how fast we are on this straight. I think Timo's running higher wings. Thank you so much for the raid, Dana. I hope you had an awesome one. Welcome in, guys. Focusing up, trying to latch onto the back of Timo. Within three tenths gives you really nice slipstream gain. Just trying to stay as close as I can. Yeah, that's perfect. So far, so good, guys. So far, so good. Okay, Nitro sits and waits. That was very late turn one, Jesus. I'm here from Dana Skirt Skirt. <laughs> Welcome in. Love it. Dana's community is always awesome. It's been a hot minute, Dana, since I've been uh, enjoying some of your content. I swear these days, I never catch you live. You've gone back to your old ways of, oh, I'm going to make sure I only stream when GB is so that, uh, so that you can't watch. I see how it is. I see. I see your game. Probably so. Like with DRS, it's insane. That was really bad. Fine, mate. Away with it. Got to be careful when our tyres drop off. That's the thing I'm worried about. It already, chat, already 17%. Late out was not lying. The crossover is so early. I reckon we would do better, or better off on mediums, you know. I would just dump the battery to stay on the back of Timo for the initial synth. Not ideal. Oh, right now. Just be no safety car then. Looks like we used it. it well, I think it was five. Burning too much battery. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, true. We, 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 we need more battery. That's true. Especially with the gap Timo's got. We definitely need to burn some more battery. Oh, sorry. Stop burning battery. God, I'm having to really be careful on the brakes now. Oh, that's a rough exit. Yeah, you tell him, GV, exactly. Data knows. Data, are we burning too much battery? Oh, late out's out. That really put me off. Oh, no, that's second warning. Late out is your fault. How dare you, GNF? No, Nitro. Don't make me bottle. Go 
going way too wide there and it's losing too much speed on the entry. We we'll have to be so careful of chat limits now. So, so careful. Oh, nice show! Oh my god, he's in the wall! Bro! Timo, what are you doing? Oh my god! Bro. I think I've just accidentally killed Nitro. I need to watch that back. Nitro, get your clip in the Discord. Chat will decide. I think I may have killed you, bro. I'm so sorry if I did. Timo, push. Otherwise, Jenna's winning. Oh, crap. Careful of chat limits. Yeah, full of chat limits. Jedo's on us. He's on us. Right, we need to get past here. Use overtake. Use overtake. Nitro's not said anything either. Mirrors? Oh, God. He's not happy. Nitro, that's a racing incident. We'll be investigated after the race. That was the exact same lap that I DNF'd at Jeddah, I think. Oh my god. The marbles in Sector 3 are disgusting. Don't you dare tell me a backmark has given this guy DRS. Don't you dare. Oh my god. Chat, we don't talk about it. Chat, we don't talk about it. Chat, we don't talk about it. Jeddo. Jeddo, you want to you go to the wall? <laughs> Are we even going to get in position anyway? Tried to nail that as best I could. Oh, we got more battery. Try to. Wait, I don't know. Take on. GG. We went from pretty much. Well, not nailed on P1, but we should have had. We should have won the race, and we managed to get a podium with about one lap. Very good. Very good, chat. Oh, dearie me. Ah, oh, dearie me. Right, Nitro, give me the clip. Come on. Give me the clip. Sorry, mate. <laughs> I'm sorry, dudes. <laughs> this guy bottles for drama, yeah, apparently. If you want to see more bottles for drama, watch me uh, kill the car tomorrow in iRacing. <laughs> Mr. Vibe Tech as well. I appreciate the, uh, the follow. Welcome in. Hector as well. Piastri, once again, Dana, thank you so much for the raid. I hope you had a fun stream. Uh, that was our community event, guys. That was our Friday night community event at Australia. We'll be doing a mystery GP next week. Make sure when the bot posts the signups at Sunday at six o'clock, you guys are signed up in the Discord server and ready to go. Um, link is in chat. Oh, okay. Never mind. Nitro's replaced it with a clip. Let's have a look. I was going to share my screen, Nitro. Hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> Chat, you decide. You, you decide what the uh, who's at fault here. I'm pretty sure. I do. Oh dear. Oh seriously, I can't. 
There's no like theater mode for this. All right, you guys are gonna have, a, have to have a pretty scuffed POV, I'm afraid. Yeah, you see what happened, chat? Um, what happened was there was a look. See, there's a there, part of the track here. There was one of those bumps. You know, what I tell you guys about these bumps in the track. He hit one of those bumps right here. Look, because when I play, he's gonna lose his rear. Look, look, look. See. Look, if we play from about here, look, see, there's there's a there's a, there's a bump pretty much bang on here. Look at that. There's proof. <laughs> Wait, hang on. <laughs> what happened to your wheel? That was the you were going so slow and that actually disconnected. But you're doing 56 kilometers when that wheel came off on reduced damage. Wow. <laughs> Exactly, you should have corrected that. Oh, dearie me. Yeah, apologies, Night Show. It was a weird one, because, I mean, you knew what I was trying to do. I didn't want to overtake chat. The aim of the game was to be P2. I think Night Show knew that. I think that's what he wanted. I wanted to be tucked into P2 here. Um, I could have easily gone for the overtake, same as Night Show has, and he's tried to fly past both. Um, and then at this point here, I'm realizing Night Show's flying past. I'm then like, okay, I have to overtake Timo if Night Show's going through. And, uh, yeah, that's what happens. There's actually, like, not a massive amount of contact, but it's at that speed, it's enough to just... Look at that. Like, it's not like it's a, you know, massive swerve. But that tiny, that tiny bit of contact there, I think Nigel's saying you're a jolt of force feedback. But that, that's not a massive impact, actually. Watching that again. If you look at the way I turned, I've not turned aggressively. I mean, look, I'm not, I'm not shying away from the blame. That's on me, but... That, that's not a mad amount of contact. I'm surprised that that obviously messed with your feedback. It just like, it's just like, it's like it glued, it's stuck, and then just released. Look at his wheel. Yeah, you were turning the wrong way, Nacho. You need to keep your wheel straight. <laughs> oh, well... It was a good race, apart from uh, apart from the bottle at the end. Um, that was a good race. GG's to uh, to Timo, by the way. Well driven that race. Well driven. Uh, you knew what I was trying to do. I feel like the the, the plan was great, <laughs> but the execution wasn't. Uh, maybe we just needed more battery, like Ben said. You know, we were, we were too low on battery. Oh dear, that was a fun race. Though. We had a lot of overtakes in that. I'm sure. Uh, sure, if we make some clips out of it, you guys will be uh, featured in a few of those because the start of the race was pretty spicy. Um, guys, we'll find someone to raid. Like I said, don't forget. Make sure you tune in tomorrow around about four o'clock UK time, and it'll be myself, Alex Gill, and Ben Daly. We'll be doing three hours combined driving. Hopefully, we will be providing Hayden and Tom have not totaled the car because if they have, then it's not it's not happening. But providing the car is still in one piece. We will be driving tomorrow at four o'clock ish, and uh, you'll you'll see me live. Um, it'll be Hayden first. If you want to find out, by the way, who is driving tomorrow? Exclamation mark stint. Um, you can go and check out the drivers channels. For example, Hayden Gullis will be starting us off. So if you want to see him kickstart um, our twelve-hour endurance race, make sure you go and follow Hayden. Keep a lookout for his live stream. That will be at midday, twelve p.m. Tom, I believe, takes over from two o'clock uh, again GMT. So for Tom, it will be three p.m. Um, he should be live on his channel with that, and then uh, and then a couple hours after it'll be it'll be us. So uh, hope you guys enjoyed that one. As always, um, sorry again, Nitro. Uh, that was not ideal. That was not ideal. That I mean, I know how that feels because that's literally what happened to me at Jetta. That's uh, that's a shitty feeling. Um, let's find someone to raid. Let's have a look. Who should we raid up? Who shall we raid up, chat? Um, got a few people on, actually. Try and see if I can find someone new. 12 hour stream. I don't think I've ever raided this person. 12 hour stream as well. All right, let's, let's, raid, uh, let's raid Archie. X Archie 7 is his name. Never raided him before. Not been on this channel. So we'll go and... Uh, Full send it over to this dude. Go and help him out. He's actually nearing the end of his stream. Jeez, he's been live for 10 hours, 15 minutes. Christ. That is a shift. That is a shift. I remember the days, chat. 
Maybe we'll maybe we'll do a big one at some point. We'll give Ray you bottled anyway. Yeah, yeah exactly. I I only bottled Nitro because I felt bad. You know, I felt bad of what what I did to you, so I couldn't possibly win that race. You know, it wouldn't have been right. Um. Yeah. Thank you, Zero. Thank you, TK, as well. And once again, thank you so much for the subs today, guys. I do appreciate it. I'll be live tomorrow with you guys. Fingers crossed everything goes to plan. I'm going to be off stream right now, setting up the iRacing stream and uh, making sure we are hopefully all good to go tomorrow. Fingers crossed. Um, but I look forward to it. See you guys there. Let's cook. Laters.